Howdy, partner. I'm Wood. Uh, Age is three and up. It says it on my box. It's not easy being a major spot. That's Mr. Potato Head to you, buddy. Uh, it's not easy being a major spot. That's Mr. Potato Head to you, buddy. Right, just, uh, it's not easy being a major spot. That's Mr. Potato Head to you, buddy. Right, just, uh, it's not easy being a major spot. I'm a bit quiet. Test, test, test. It's not easy being a major spot. I'm a bit quiet. Test, test, test. It's not easy being a major spot. I'm a bit quiet. Test, test, test. It's not easy being a major spot. Ha. I'm a bit quiet. Ha. Test, test, test. It's not easy being a major spot. Ha. I'm a bit quiet. Ha. Um, why, why? Ha! 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 Why, why? Ha! That's Mr. Potato Head to you, buddy. Hmm. Okay, that's getting annoying. Ugh, oh, man. Mike doesn't sound that good for some reason. Why is it going so low? <laughs> Test. Alright. Alright. That's decent enough. What? Whatever. That's Mr. Potato Head to you, buddy. That's decent enough. What? Whatever. Okay. Age is three and up. It says it on my box. I'll put it That's on. That's Mr. Potato enough. Head to you, what, buddy. Whatever. Put the sound on four. It's not easy being a. I'll put it on. That's Mr. Potato Head to you, buddy. Put the sound on four. It's not easy being a. Put the sound on four. It's not easy being a. Put the sound on four. It's not easy being a. Put the sound on four. Mm-hmm. <laughs> oh, I need to meet the thing now. We'll just leave it. Alright. Alright, whatever, let's just start. <laughs> Should be fine. That's Mr. Potato Head to you, buddy. 
tomato watcher. Why, why can I not I see read it. any of the chat properly? I ch okay, I need I need to go back and stream labs a second. I can not read the chat properly. The colors will oh, messed up. I don't know if I can take losing. Shut up, Rex. <laughs> All right, where's the thing on her? Uh, chat books. No, that's not it. Is it? Wait, here it is. Uh, blue, maybe. Mm. No, I'll just make it white. I don't want to make it fancy. them here but I just don't feel it I should be able to read the uh, chat now oh I don't know if I can take losing that's right I am. oh man okay still got like 60 missions to do I think I get yeah that that that's a little better now I can read it. Oh. How do I? <laughs> I completely forgot how to play this game. <laughs> you need. I need to use like uh, the um, R2 or the uh, shoulder buttons to uh, use the items. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna try and finish the game today. I'm not sure if I will, but no again though. Cause I'd like to move on to something uh -oh. else soon. Nah, I'm just gonna reset this. I suck. I cannot like the accurate the items in this game for some reason. Try and hit an enemy when they already ho they're holding on to something. They just it protects them. So I'm gonna go for someone else. Yo, is that... <laughs> is that you, Phantom? Uh -oh. Pothead's coming to get you. <laughs> the the other guy in the chat. <laughs> oh man. Oh, that sucks. Okay. I'm not the biggest fan of these. I much prefer the, the uh, Smash challenges where it's like an actual battle arena. 
This just kind of makes me f think of like the uh, vanilla Mario Kart 8 battle mode that sucked. <laughs> So like this kind of this this kind of thing is not designed around normal courses like this. I mean, I also suck, which is also a factor, but you know, still. Oh come on! Oh okay, that works. No, I wouldn't miss. Oh! I love the the uh, red ones when you get the electricity thing, because that, that's like... If you're like... In range, that's a guaranteed hit pretty much. So... Kind of yoloing it. Yes. Right. The heck was that? Oh, okay, no, that's normal. So the head just kind of goes back and forth on on this part. Yeah. Right, come and just die. I'm so done with this. I think I'm like programmed to like just loop around the opposite. Like, uh, away from you. Like, play the stage like normal away from you, I mean. And it just makes it annoying to catch up. Please use that up. Of course there was another one there. She's not gonna get rid of it, is she? I can still see that. We haven't even done one challenge yet, come on. Where's that go? No, off. But like, still alive. Feet with the sheep. Yeah, boy. Come on. Stop getting items. <laughs> My force exactly. This is dumb.
And I can't die because otherwise I have to start the whole thing again. I don't even don't even know if I can die. No. So how are you guys doing? Uh, tomorrow I watch her uh, and uh, <laughs> the other guy, <laughs> but yeah, or whatever. <laughs> I'm not saying the other word. I've been doing okay. Kind of jobless right now, but you're okay. Well, yeah, that's fine. Yeah, me neither. To be quite honest with you. Yes, yes, yes. Oh, finally, good lord. That was stupid. <laughs> I'm not the biggest fan of that map either, to be quite honest, but that's neither here nor there. Head in this corner, yip, yip, yippee! Lap trial challenge. <laughs> of course, this is. Oh, well, is it? This is gonna be simple, so. Time attack, pretty much. If I don't bash into a wall. Whoa. You know, it's really weird, like, when you play this compared to, like, any other Whoa. kart racer out there, pretty much. Because there's no drifting in this game whatsoever. Which might be a little bit weird to get used to. Yeah, that was like really quick, wow. It's like you have missions that take like 10 years and then you have like ones like that that took like 5 seconds. Alright. Oh, what the heck? Oh. I need to turn you off, I didn't even know- I didn't even know she joined the call, man. <laughs> I'm a ninja. You're not, you're not supposed to know that I'm here. I I just started hearing a voice. <laughs> I'm a ninja. Uh. Come on, Xbox, sign me in. Okay, good. Oh, my Xbox. I thought having issues with these Xbox games, like, honestly. But the update came out faster oh, and it took me three days to get it working properly. So two oh, it was like, oh, I'm going to be okay. And then I did the third time and I was like, okay, go to the third I'm fucking with the I like to find a little bit of forces. Yeah. It's not a generation since the update and I don't have to get that. Also, tomorrow watch, right? I, I cannot wake up early at all. <laughs> like, 8 a.m. is like... It's like alien to me. Huh? I need to... I, I, I've never been this excited about... Like, yeah, I'm expi excited for Spyro. I'm like super excited for Spyro. But I've never been this excited for a Sonic Racing game since Riders. <laughs> I don't know why I'm super excited for Team Sonic Racing. I guess it's because it's just not like... All Star, and I, I don't get me wrong, I love All Star. I love all the All Star characters. I do mostly Knights, but I'm just like, can we just have Sonic? Can we just have Sonic and his friends? That's yeah. all I want. <laughs> I've never been so excited for this. It's just I'm super pumped. I don't know why <laughs> I'm super pumped. <laughs> I'm mostly hoping we see the um, Babylon robes again. I miss them. Yeah. <sighs> I've heard there's gonna be like. 15 or so characters yeah there's gonna be like 15 or so characters from what i've read and there's gonna be three distinct character types so i'm going to assume they're gonna bring back the speed power and flight things 
Yeah. I just want to punch Metal Sonic in the face. Where is he? That's all I want to do right now. Uh, not Arsenal Pyramid, not Body in the Rock. Also, quick uh, question for the chat uh, right now. Can you guys hear Maddie? Hi. <laughs> yeah. Don't mind me, I'm sick. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay. Where are. Where is Miller Sonic? I can't find him. Oh, there he is. Found him. Never mind. I was like, it's the San Francisco Bridge. <laughs> <laughs> Like, don't really not San Francisco. San Francisco's it. Then he went too hard on the track. Oh, you can hear it, okay. <laughs> I don't see him anyway. Oh, this okay. Can't be happening. Yeah, Maddie's been sick for a while, so she's a lot quieter than usual. Yeah. Sorry about that. Heads up, everybody! <laughs> it's showtime! <laughs> that thing exploded. Huh? How many Death Egg robots can you make? 10,000. <laughs> well, what game are you playing? 10,000. Hey. I'm just playing a level, of course. It's mostly Whoa. the Metal Sonic uh. fight because, because the song is jamming. I love that they remixed the uh, US Stardust Speedway theme. Yeah. Which is a bit more melancholy in, yeah. in my way of thinking it. Like, if you listen to the Generations version, and even the original version, it just, just sounds so melancholy. Yeah. I mean, in this situation. I mean, I love Japanese Stardust Speedway to, to, to my freaking death. And I will always love it forever. Yeah. But the US ones, it gives me feelings. I got hit, damn it. I'm here, Metal Sonic. Yeah, I can kind of feel that, yeah. It's interesting how different you can make a, uh, make something feel with a change in music. Yeah. I just wish they'd stop using All Hills Shadow. Like, can I have to throw it all away for once, please? Yeah. Oops, I died. <laughs> no. <laughs> Oops, I died. <laughs> Oops, I died. This Huffwick is a fight anyway. Oh, I haven't heard this part of the song. That must be new. Almost be the full version that we didn't get. I died. I died. <laughs> now chat's probably gonna make fun of me. Because <laughs> I died. I'm terrible at Sonic games. I love Sonic games, but I'm terrible at them. <laughs> <laughs> One of my friends uh, uh, is, isn't the best either. <laughs> Toy Story Battle Royale, yeah, pretty much. As to the question of why Metal Sonic is so big, is that, that is actually a Sonic the Fighters reference of why he's so large. Mm. He got fat. <laughs> Uh. Metal Sonic, you got that. <laughs> oh, this game is so cheesy. I don't care if it's got bad love for the It's so fucking cheesy. I love it. Yeah, I didn't I mean, know like, Sonic. In Force's case, like, the Phantom movie can just do whatever. Fuck the Phantom movie. Fuck Infinite. <laughs> Get it out of uh. here. I would really like to see him redeemed as a villain. I am like, the darkest of days. Huh? Edge. <laughs> you know, you know, you know. People say Shadow is edgy. No, Shadow is not edgy. It's just that, it's just that, like, people's like, oh my god, he's so edgy. He uses a gun. No, he's someone who has motives. Infinite is just pure edge. Okay, shut up. This is completely different. <laughs> it's two completely different types of edge. Did you see Infinite in Lego Dimensions making fucking flower crowns? I don't think so. Yeah. So, like sh Shadow is like more edgy in terms of like having a dark backstory. Infinite is just edge and like me me. <laughs> <laughs> I wonder if you prove that was win. I actually, uh, Tomato Watcher, I, I actually like most modern Sonic games. Generations is so 
I don't think anybody would contest that. That Jenna thinks it's fantastic. Yeah. I would recommend uh, Modern Sonics. I would. Um... Who's vibrating? Oh, that's me. Someone's sending me a message. Sorry about that. Don't, don't, don't worry fine. about that if you heard that. It's my phone. Oh, Graffy's just giving me the hug. Everybody's hugging me because I'm sick. <laughs> yeah. Ugh. You don't have the right system, so that's, that's, that's fine. Yeah, um, Modern Sonic games, there's a lot. Um, if you really want to get into the series, I recommend the Advanced Trilogy, because they're a bit easier to get into, and to handle yeah. everybody's head. Um, I don't know if you're a fan of fighting games at all, but I personally love Sonic Battle. Oh. That was pretty fun. The fun one. Yeah. I would actually keep it because fuck that lost story and that Sonic and Shadow fight. It's like, it's like, who's the bigger threat? Shadow or Sonic? It's Shadow, because Shadow could fucking kill you in two hits. <laughs> no. no. But like, um... It's, it's fucking Chaos Snap, Oof, and you're dead. You could play like... I haven't... I've only played a bit of the Vance one, but, um... Yeah, these guys, uh... Say it's pretty good, so... Um, my personal favorite, I know people don't like Advanced 3 because of the terrible level design and the whole chow mechanic, get the, get the, like, chow samples, but I like 3 because yeah. it gives you team ups, and it's like, it's, it felt to me like it was a precursor for heroes, honestly, kind of. Yeah. Um, and the exact kind of, mean. that kind of gameplay style was kind of brought back in Sonic for Episode 2 with Tails. Yeah, uh, I wish they could have a team name, like, in, in the Team Jubilee, um, Sonic and Tails are unbreakable bonds, they show how close they are. <laughs> yeah. That, that fucking, that fucking argument in the fucking Lost World, I haven't played it, but I've heard it, and it's like, you just end it more than me, it's just like, Oh fuck! Yeah. <laughs> What's wrong with you? Like you just <laughs> randomly <laughs> like go and all like. Are you going through puberty? <laughs> Are you going through puberty? Is this what's happening? Mm -hmm. I wouldn't put it past him. Hands up, everybody! It's you can't be eight forever. <laughs> per uh, apparently, tomorrow's heard people say advanced two is unfair and way too focused on speed. Yeah, yeah, that, that's pretty much it. Mm. I mean, like, I can see the speed part, I don't know about the unfair part. Game is bad. I would recommend Advanced 2, because it's where Queen made her debut, and she's yeah. had fun, and she holds a weapon of mass destruction. Oh, yeah. And that weapon of mass destruction is Queen, not Queen 2. Yeah. She's a, she's a fucking monster. <laughs> Jesus, like, <laughs> no, Cream throws herself. <laughs> cream, cream throws herself. I would too oh. believe that she is a weapon of mass destruction, but she doesn't mm. fight on her own because she doesn't want to hurt. She doesn't want to up her mother. Uh, we never see Vanilla anymore. We never see her anymore. We never see Cream anymore. Can you can saw you Vanilla like once in one of the advanced games, didn't you? You see her in two. You see her at the end of Cream Story, and then you see her at the true final boss. Right. She gets kidnapped again. And that whole scene where Supersonic is like holding a castle full of animals, it's going into the atmosphere, and just saves her, and I'm just like, yeah. That's like yeah, that's bad. cool. Yeah. I'm like, yeah. I remember this, and like, uh, uh, um, oh. fake, uh, leak or whatever you want to call it. There was, like, this game called like Sonic Excursion uh, oh. and like like apparently like it was like gonna it was like bringing back emblems and like different stories and stuff and um, the first cat scene with Amy's story I think was like him and uh, her and Cream at um, just having like tea at Cream's house or something like that <laughs> I would have killed for that yeah. They totally, they totally sit together and have tea. Like in that episode of Sonic X, where. Yeah. Oh my god, I fucking love Sonic X. Where hey. Amy's at Cream in Vanilla's house, and then Eggman's out there in the ship taunting her. 
Yeah. I wanna- I wanna those hit- are fucking, Those are fucking hammer. Yeah. I will not! Don't! Oh yeah? You're my Sonic High from another planet! Boom! Hot potato <laughs> coming through! It's in the face. I wanna <laughs> see, like, more... Uh, of a bond between Amy and Crane. Cause like, they're supposed to- They're and supposed to be, like, okay, Sonic and Tails, but... They- I don't think they've <laughs> done that enough in the games. Yeah, they it's a I, it, they do it quite they did it quite decent quite decently in like Sonic X and stuff. But yeah. My absolute favorite part about Sonic X is the whole chaotic and why they were in the fucking first place. Yeah, I like how they're basically comic relief. Please help me, my daughter just killed the hacker. The hacker's like, okay. Yeah. Man, she's pretty. Yeah. <laughs> oh, oh man. Oh. What am I doing in this picture right now? Cats are fighting. Oh. Yeah, uh, t uh, tomorrow, what's your. Uh, do you have, like, a decent. PC that can run like Steam games or anything like that. Because if you do, I, there's um, a lot of Sonic games you can find on there as well. Uh, they have, uh, I think they have some of the Genesis titles. They have the Advance, see, Adventure, so Adventure 1 and 2. Oh. I think Unleashed at this point? I don't think Unleashed is there, but. Boo. I really want them to put that on there. Alright, let's go to this planet so we can get these myths out of the way, and then I can do a loyalty mission. <laughs> Since playing Mass Effect Andromeda, I've been seeing some weird shit. And when I mean by weird shit, I mean the pop-in. You know when textures pop in? Kind yeah. of like when you play Skyrim. Yeah, and some of the models T pose for like a second, like a millisecond, and then they just disappear. And I'm like, ah, oh, yes, the mysterious T pose. <laughs> <laughs> it's not the game's fault. It's, it's not Bioware's fault. I'm blaming EA for this one. Mm. Sometimes, you, like, the, uh, the, the publisher is like rushes the developers. Like, we want the game out to get money. And, like, that sometimes just costs. Like, they have to cut corners because of that, I guess. Which is why they held freaking Final Fantasy XV for like an extra year so they can actually figure out all the bugs and then the developers got sent death threats. Yeah, that was a thing. Yeah. It's like, we've been waiting ten years for this, and blah 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 say it, but the game's not for you. Yeah. It's not for you. What the fuck up? Oh. I think at that point, uh, 15, they were just like, let's just, we need to get the game out. <laughs> Because like, people have been waiting yeah. for so long. Yeah, like it took... Um, 2015, 2018, it took... Two, three, two, three years for the city of NT to come out. Yeah. And I was pretty okay with that because Japanese arcade, blah blah blah, had to finalize a roster at some point before they can add new characters because the, I hear they're going to be adding new characters all the time, so... Yeah, and I mean, like, uh, 15 was, like, versus 13 at some point, and, like, they changed directors from, like, uh, Nomura to some other guy that I don't know the name yeah. of. Yeah, there was a chick called Stella, and she was supposed to be better than Luna Freya by, like, 50 miles, and they're like, nah, let's rewrite her. Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> I just... I, I don't... Not to harp on the game or anything, but I don't like Noctis, as everybody knows, but I don't get the relation. I don't feel... Like, Final Fantasy IV with Cecil and Rosa. I believe they're in love. Yeah. I believe it. But with Noctis and Luna, I don't actually feel it or believe it. Well, I, I, I know... I don't really know many of the characters <laughs> at all. I just don't... I just don't believe that they're actually in love. Is what I'm getting at. I I didn't even I didn't even know there was like a love interest subplot in oh. 15. 
They were gonna get married. Yes. And then shit happened. I will always prefer Noctis' as friend. Yeah. Like, I, 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 I barely know anything about this game, so take this with a grain of salt, but I, I've heard the story is just bad. Meh. Nah. Mm. I, I think it's the villain as a Sephiroth on steroids, but written better. You know you've made a great game when the, the only, only redeeming factor the NPCs and the villain. Mm. But take that with a grain of salt. If C50 fans are listening to me and listening to my bitter ass, I'm sorry, but it's just my opinion. Mm. Everyone is a validated to their opinion. Yeah. This is why I think Shadow the Hedgehog is okay, but not a great game. Which is why I like I love Secret Rings and no one else does. <laughs> That's my opinion. Why are Drac and Liam getting fucking crunk? Come on, don't get drunk. We have we have a freaking world to settle. Come on, don't go over here and get crunk. I can't get crunk. Yeah, all right, PB. What do you want? Hey, girl. You're. Oh God. Oh no, she's stumbling around. She is drunk. Okay, I know who <laughs> I know who okay, Bart beat Bart eat a boy is now. <laughs> oh, who is it? <laughs> um it's uh, someone called Greek God in the uh, Love Live chat. Ah, oh. oh. well, hello. <laughs> I'm not into idol stuff, but hello. I'm saying hello to you now. Hello. Hello. Oh, Liam. Oh, please don't tell me this is one of those things where I have to just keep doing a million laps until everyone gets eliminated. Her model just popped in. Okay, fantastic. No. Uh. Uh, <laughs> what is your? I don't know if I've ever heard what your favorite Final Fantasy is. Oh, mine. Yeah. Um, I have, I have a lot, but my top two favorites are four and five. Okay. Four for the story. The sequel was terrible. Do not play Final Fantasy for the after years, unless you want to go through terrible fanfiction writing. And <laughs> five for the class system. Final Fantasy V's story is not the best written, but it's plausible and good for what it was made, but the class system and the job system is the bigger part of Final Fantasy V, which is why it was reused for Bravely Default. Mm. See, the only uh, Final Fantasy game I've really played is 4, and uh, um, like a, I guess like a bit of 14, I, guess, I suppose, but... You know. You played a bit of four. That's all I can ask of you. Well, no, I, 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 fi I finished, I finished four, and I want to get to five someday. But ah, so you, so you know about the Spoony Bard? Yeah. <laughs> and like how um, Sid like explodes and survives. <laughs> And now you know, now you know why Kane is my favorite Final Fantasy IV character. <laughs> he was like my last they man standing out. in the uh, final boss fight. This game's a badass. Also, that love triangle that they pulled completely out of nowhere and it made me angry. Like, yeah. <laughs> I'm like, can can you fucking not? Can mm. can you can you fucking not? Can you, can you stop that? Like, please, please, <laughs> please. <laughs> Yeah, I, I, I'm not sure if I'm going to play any other sequels, but I want to at least play, uh, well, I've, I've already, I've gone through 4 now, so I, uh, I want to play 5 through 10, at the very least. Uh -oh. 
Mm. I'm not a big fan of tin. And everybody's like, oh, it's like the most best game ever. Like, yeah, it is. I don't like the... I, I have an issue with love stories written in video games most of the time. <laughs> oh, I uh, know. As, 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 as if it's, that's gonna come as a fucking shock, which is why I didn't like Part 1. The game was okay, but the whole, like, freaking sort of semi love triangle between Sora and Kyrie and Riku is just like, I'm like, kill it, burn it. Oh, kill it, was fun. Burn it, burn it. Burn I'll it. say, I'll say I this much. I, I'm much more of a Kingdom Hearts fan than I am a Final Fantasy fan. And you probably prefer the whole Riku is like oh. big brother instead of love interest, right? Uh, that... Yeah, that that makes more sense. But like... I don't know. Uh, I enjoy my time with FF4 and the... I'm interested to see how the other games play and all the... Uh, the... You know, something about Kingdom Hearts just makes me gravitate towards it more. And I just like the gameplay system. Yeah. yeah. Alright. I bought Subli the plant. Good. And as convoluted as a story can be, I do actually I do enjoy it. <laughs> twist here, twist here. The organization 13 are actually supposed to be all Xehanort. We can control from their hearts. Oh wait, they're betrayed. Oh shit. One of them's turned back into a somebody. Oh shit. Part of me has a feel- <laughs> This is still sleeping. <laughs> I- I- It gives- Zigba gives me the feeling that he has ulterior oh. motives. But I don't know why, mm. but like, feels like he has something- He's doing this he's for his like... own reasons. He's not like Axel who's like, grown a character and, you know, is actually- Hey, I actually care about this guy. Like, come on, let's let's go. Let's go. Let's yeah. do the thing. Come on, let's do the thing. You know, like Zipper, I think he mostly wants. To... Like he I clearly knows Axel more can... than the, more than yeah. the others. He's, he seems shifty. Yeah. He seems shifty and shady. And you know what happens to shady people in Kingdom Hearts? They either blow up or re-kill them themselves, or they run away. Yeah. <laughs> they blow up. Suvi, I have your. Yes, I know Pete is looking for me. Callow, shut up. Here, Suvi, take your plant. Well, I imagine if, like, Zibala like, ends up betraying Zen or something. <laughs> like, if Marluxia is back, the rest of the organization is going to be back, and they're either going to go full traitor or we're going to have to kill them again. Yeah, that's just so interesting, because like, if Marluxia is back, like, we, we know how he was, like, he and, like, the group were, like, trying to. Um, dethrone Zemnus for lack of a better word. Uh, and like, there's no way he'd just be willing to join the organization again like that. Mm. So either he's like just kind of waiting to strike back at the right time, or he's making a different organization with like the uh, the other guys that died from Castle of Oblivion that like were with him. And like making their own team to yeah. fight back. I don't know. Then again, Marluxia wanted to cut the organization in half so he could take over. Yeah. That was like. <laughs> and everybody was in it for their own motives. And Axel was supposed to be dead long fucking time ago, but the writers were like, we like him too much. He was supposed to die like three <laughs> times. Yeah, and they kept him alive because the writers liked him too much. See what I mean? Sometimes characters get too popular within the own writing team that they that they're like, you know, yeah. have to keep them around. Like, I hear, um, I hear Blaze is that that's the reason why Blaze keeps showing up in like random games because in like some games where she's not integral to the plot is because people love her so much. Yeah, she wasn't in the forces for some reason. Yes, they, 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 that'd be too convoluted, and that's why they saved her for the comics. <laughs> yeah, I guess. It's, it's just weird how she was there, with, uh, she wasn't there, but Silver was. Like, yeah. I don't know. I, I, can understand why Sil I can understand why Silver's there, though. Like, you know, he has to help protect the present so his future doesn't turn into bad. 
I just like that head cannon that uh, I think Lewis made where it's like, um, no, it might have been you, I can't remember where it's like Blaze. It's breaking out. Cream isn't there either, so yeah. Will takes her to the, takes her to Blaze and like you gotta keep her safe. Yeah, yeah, something like that. Like, I I can I can believe something like that because I would I not can. put Cream in a war zone. Yeah, she's she's too young. I mean, she she's fine going on adventures with Amy, but in yeah. terms of a war zone, like no, you don't. Put that, that's too. too that's way too like. In hard, like, in terms. Ta ta Tails is different. Tails, is, Tails was at a point where he was mature enough to handle stuff on his own, and then they could have handled that whole thing better. But you know, yeah. writing. Yeah. I think the, I think the Japanese version is much better in terms of the writing. Yeah. Oh, fucking infinite, and the whole like fake sprite. Like, Zavik and everybody else looked fine, but you can tell the shadows are fakes. Because <laughs> they yeah. have Mephilus eyes. You can yeah. tell that they're fakes! Yeah. But nobody's that smart enough. No one's yeah. that smart enough just to look directly in the eyes and just figure out something's wrong. Yeah. I think I'm the only one smart enough to do that. <laughs> I think that's actually what, in my own little, little resistance, Thing that happens in the game. That's how Cat Knight actually figures out that they're fakes. <laughs> yeah, I mean, like this is the series where like people can like tell the difference between Sonic and Shadow. So yeah, there's not even physical description. Like you don't even have chest fluff on your on your Sonic. You just you just got tummy. <laughs> yeah. Poke him. <laughs> Poke him. Yeah. Poke him. That's my favorite thing about classic Sonic. It's like, hey, did you gain weight? And he's just sitting there rubbing his belly, just looking depressed. Uh, uh, <laughs> I'm like, Knuckles, don't make fun of him. Uh, don't be me, Knuckles. <coughs> I guess I'll don't give like, uh, I'll give uh, SA2 a little bit, of, a little bit of snack uh, since uh, like the whole situation was happening at night. I guess you can like. Argue, uh, people might have just thought like, oh, that's just Sonic's like fur dark because because it's like night out or whatever. Like uh, that's that's the only excuse I can really give it. That whole saga in Sonic X is handled, I think, better because all you see is a silhouette and a cocky grin. <laughs> that's all you see. Yeah, that <laughs> that that, that like, makes it a oh. lot more believable because like. You know, still a You're like, hold on a second. That's Sonic. Yeah. We're not a tank Yeah. Okay. <laughs> because like, I'm not feeling very chatty. Because like the only <laughs> hedgehogs they know are Sonic and Amy. So. Yeah. And then her shadow was like, I want revenge because Maria. Jesus, Maria. Watch the I want. Revenge. So I love seeing in the fandom of like, like fan art and fanfics of Maria and Shadow being like siblings, and I'm like, that's what I'm here for. Uh. It's cute, cute shit. And then they actually write like different interpretations of how she dies, and I'm like, can you not, can you stop that, like please? I was having a good time, <laughs> and uh. then you decided to ruin it. <laughs> Just, oh dear God, he's over no. it at this point. It, it, oh dear God, no. I think in, in characterization, watch, he's over it. I think Tomorrow Watch is going a bit insane right now. Sonic fandom? Uh, this is why I make my own OCs and self-inserts and not give a fuck about the fandom and what they say. Middle finger. Mm. Maddie gives the middle finger. She does not care. Oh, man. I'm 23 years old and I do not give a shit. You can't tell me how to have fun. <laughs> Still not as bad as stars. Yeah, the stars fandom is has been pretty toxic uh, the past year or so. Nice I've been here for two minutes and no one noticed. Uh, I'm sorry. No. I I didn't no, hear it. No, 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 it's it's cool. I've been mastering the art of invisibility. I haven't even very still. I yeah, because I I didn't hear any like uh, notifications. No, sounds. I didn't say anything. <laughs> I just oh, walked so in and see if anyone would notice, but no one did. Okay. <laughs> so, uh, so uh, it's working. 
His nephew Mercer will use FBO now. Damn it, I missed True Baker. Damn it. Well, I don't mind Matthew Mercer. I know, but it's... Okay, I have I have this thing with voice actors, right? If they're pleasing to my ear, I immediately like them and get attached to them. Like, Liam O'Brien, he's got, like, gravelliness to his voice when he voices villains. Kirk Thornton, he voices Shadow. He's also got a gravelliness, and I, I approve that. And the point was voicing Espio, it was like, he's calm and like, and I was just like, fucking hell, stop it! I don't mind that, though. The time, I always thought Kirk Thornton was just a shitty version of Davy Humphrey's Shadow. Uh, yeah. I I just I feel just like sh uh, um, was it? Um, Kirk Thornton? Yeah, Kirk Thornton just hasn't had the right enough time to really evolve Shadow or what? I don't know. Like I don't think there's really been enough time to. I feel like direction. Something. Well, that yeah. just like the uh, the games themselves. Cause they don't really they haven't really had given Shadow a lot of time. I, he, he was really good in forces, I'll admit. Yeah, yeah. I mean, the only time that they actually had perfect time for mix acting was free riders, and everybody was out of character, like, fucking... Like, that, you could tell they were, like, just getting into their roles in that game. That's what happens when they start voicing. It's like, yeah. when you, they first start voicing, it's kind of like... Unless you have really stellar... Excuse me, voice performances or voice direction, then it's not gonna sound great at the start. Yeah. And... Like, Amy was mean, but like, Cream was like the only one who kind of stayed in character. Tails kind of as well, and the Babylon Rogues, but Knuckles was rude. You have to take these bozos on first. One, they're your friends. Two, you should know who Cream is because you went on an adventure with her twice. You're pretty much like a surrogate big brother. Kind of. And three, shut the fuck up! <laughs> Knuckles is the surrogate big brother who has to pay the bills every once in a while. Yeah. <laughs> he, 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 it's like every month he gets like a fucking bill in the mail and he's just like, fuck. It doesn't help the fact that the cut the cut season for your riders are so boring to watch. They look they look yeah, like I... they were just made in like two months. Yeah. Not even. It sucks because the riders' cutscenes used to be really entertaining and goofy, and like actual even animation was. Like, yeah, even though they looked like weird as hell. <laughs> I mean, they did, but like. Yeah. No noodle Sonic. Noodle. But like, there was actual, there's like actual animation going on, and there's like there's like cartoony things going on, and it's entertaining to watch. Yeah, I love um, in the first Riders game. I forget what the context was, but I remember Tails just looking really pissed off at one point. He's holding a board or some shit. Yeah. Oh yeah, um, yeah, yeah. I think, yeah. I think it was when Wave. Uh, like he Wave looks really pissed. Wave made fun of him. My favorite part was when Tails was trying to beat, tell Knuckles how boards work, and his like face and his eyes go. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I'm surprised you haven't seen more of that in cutscenes in the series. Listen, I love Knuckles, but Boom Knuckles is a bit too dumb for my liking, but I still love Knuckles. Yeah. I will put the buff. Boom Knuckles is some of the best jokes, like, ever in that show. I, I know. I'm kind of- I, he, like, he, is a, he is a bit too dumb. I don't know, that's just- yeah. I feel like- People just think naivete equals dumb, and it really doesn't. Because, like, Knuckles, no, doesn't. Knuckles was never really dumb dumb. Like, people seem to really misunderstand that. He's, he's just horribly naive. Yeah. According, according to his character profile, Knuckles believes in the good of people. He believes yeah. that there are some good in people, which is why he just trick the it, because he believes that there's some good in people. And yet, no, no, no. He didn't, he didn't yeah. really seem to get tricked. And by bringing the last Mania Adventures part. Hmm. Yeah. He's just kind of a dick. <laughs> he just threw him oh, away. He was like really Break. paranoid. Yeah. I mean, then again, he's had that emerald stolen and broken multiple times, so I understand why he'd be like, like a little bit stingy with it. Well, I mean, in the main. Well, at the very least, he's a good guardian. Well, I mean, in, 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 the main, in the Mania timeline, or what you want to call it, like, the Adventure Games... I call it Earth 2. Yeah. The Earth 2 timeline. Oh, yeah, we can go with that. Like, the, in, that, in that case, like, the, uh, the Adventure Games d didn't... haven't happened. So, the Emerald never shattered. Well, that's true. 
Oh, I just really enjoy the cartoony nature of the Mania Adventures shorts. Oh yeah, I do as well. Like with people stealing, stealing, trying to steal the but Rouge isn't around yet, so he just has to deal with ignorance to take it. I'd like to see the main if Mania continues after Plus. I'd love to see classic interpretations of Shadow and Rouge and all the other characters. Yeah. And that'd like, be really be awesome. Cute. That'd be cool, they'd yeah. Be cool. They'd be fucking adorable, and I would want plushies immediately. Yeah. Like, I wonder if... Plushy Shadow. <laughs> uh, like, I wonder if, like, like, Shadow and all that yeah. still, like, exists somewhere in that world. I don't know, the adventure games always kind of felt really weird and different compared to the classics, in a lot of ways. Yeah. So I imagine if they were to make them in like the Earth 2 timeline, they'd probably have the same story, but they'd find a way to tie it in better, I guess. Yeah. But like, um, going back to like Knuckles for a second, like, uh, you really can't blame him for like, uh, thinking Sonic's the bad guy, because like, he really has like nothing to go off of. Like, cause, like, he, he doesn't even know they're there. Yeah, and like, he doesn't know who who's like, the good guy or who's the bad guy, because like, there's that, um, moral or whatever in the uh, Hidden Palace that like depicts the like, yeah, the mural, uh, with like Super Sonic going about going against the <coughs> Death Egg robot, but with um, in Knuckles' perspective, he doesn't really know like if uh, if Sonic's like trying to steal the emerald from Eggman or or if like and like Eggman's trying to take it away from him or. Like, Sonic's trying to get it back. Like, he doesn't know the context, is the, is the, is the thing. Mm -hmm. My favorite thing about Color is DS. They actually sat down and watched the playthrough. And voice clips are pretty good, because you know how, like, the DS can compress voice clips and terrible sometimes. Voice clips are good. My favorite thing is, like, everybody- Knuckles saw he got tricked by Eggman again, so did everybody else, and Rouge is like, nah, I was the one that tricked you this time, and I'm like, what the fuck? <laughs> why, girl? Girl, why? Rouge would do that. Girl, why you gonna do this? <laughs> girl! Uh... I said I want a nice clean- You know what, I can see Rouge being like a bitch to Knuckles in that way. Yeah. But like, I- It's cause she likes him. I w in the in the like the main adventures, I want to see more action like that where like Knuckles just goes all like crazy on like <laughs> robots and stuff because like that was nuts. My God, that <laughs> last robot! Jesus Christ! Yeah, it looked like it's like, like I, I spirit just went flying out. Him, like, like that fucking last uppercut he gave. I just imagine he, if he did that to like anyone else, they like their heads would come off. Oh Lord. Cause I, cause he looked like he was not holding back in the slightest with that. <laughs> cause I, I, I don't feel like we've really seen what Knuckles is capable of like that much. The Archie books did a good job of showing when he was yeah, in, in the in the yeah. comics, especially the new universe, where Shadow was like being an asshole. Like Knuckles could take on Shadow, and that's pretty amazing. Yeah, he fought like, Shadow to a fucking standstill. I still, the I still believe that Knuckles is strong, which is annoying. I, yeah, I, I still believe, um, like Knuckles, like, in terms of just raw power, is still the strongest oh. Sonic character. Yeah. He's the strongest, but I imagine when it comes to chaos powers, I imagine him just being more to the point. Yeah. Whereas Shadow is just more technique based, I guess. Yeah, yeah. I'm the ultimate yeah, life That's a good way to the separate them. Your ultimate life on face can't beat my fist. Because uh, <laughs> yeah. like, Shadow uses stuff like Curse Control and all that. Chaos Spears. Yeah. I'd also yeah. make it to where Shadow, you know, he can have a Chaos Emerald and enhance his power, but Knuckles doesn't need that. Yeah. I mean, it's he doesn't, he, it can still enhance it, but he doesn't need it, because I always thought Knuckles was like a living Chaos Emerald already, in terms Pretty of just sheer much. strength. Pretty much. I mean... I, th I, think, hmm. I think living I next to Master nice Emerald is so fucking long. Yeah, like, that's probably something. like... That's probably like giving him some weird abilities. That's what they did in the original Archie run, except it was Knuckles' father who exposed him as a little egg to Master Emerald's power, and that's why he's yeah. Knuckles is so strong. I'm like, that's kind of fucked up. 
I mean, I, I, like, being near the Master Emblem so long, I guess, can explain why he can, like, sense it, I guess. I don't know. It has to do, it probably has something to do. I don't really know what Master Emerald does. It's just like a yeah. big emerald, and that's it. Yeah. I mean, it, it might have something to do with, like, just, like, Knuckles' ancestry and all that. What? Like, yeah, it's what been I there think since the old to... times. Yeah. What I think the Master Emerald is supposed to do is what to call Sam. The servers of the seven. Blah 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 blah. It's supposed to nullify the Chaos Emerald as if they go out of control. That is what I hope to do. Well, I mean, like, if to be, so... the big, to be the big fuck you button if things get crazy. Well, I mean, the Master Emerald is also probably, like, as yeah. powerful, if not more, than all seven emeralds combined. So. Because, like, you've seen in, like, Sonic 3 and Knuckles, like, Mega Sonic turn, can turn super with just the Master Emerald alone. Yeah, they never really have a situation where the Master Emerald nullifies the Chaos Emeralds. Except for uh, Adventure, Ooh, Adventure Two. Yeah, the fucking bio lizard. Fuck that guy. That's the only time they do something like that, really. Yeah, it's, it's like after Master that. Emerald. After that, it in your pocket. Um, it's like after Adventure Two. Um, actually, no, the advanced games, Advanced Three specifically, they stopped. Actually, no, never mind. It's the Rivals games. I think mentioned the Master Emerald at some point. I don't even know. I never, yeah, I never played. I, the, I never played the Rivals games. But I, I remember played, watching some playthroughs of it. Yeah. I play. I played Rivals. I'm playing Rivals two right now. I'm playing a Shadow during Shadow's part of the story. Mask Emerald is there. It was stuck inside an Emerald detector for the whole fucking plot. Yeah. <laughs> of Knuckles. I mean, it's, it's, no, I don't think Knuckles right would there. need an Emerald detector. Mm. <laughs> No, Rouge needed it because she needs to go get all the jewels. Okay, you know, Rouge. But yeah, no, yeah. Knuckles is like, I gotta but, find all the jewels. But the Master Emerald did go missing. It did, it did go I gotta go get the diamonds so for the bitch. Oh, <laughs> um, yeah. yeah. You know what they say, diamonds are a girl's best friend. But like, in terms of like the and main... I like, in terms of the main series, like, it's funny how the Master Emerald just kind of vanished after I say to like... Hero, heroes onwards, like, it just doesn't matter. I know, it's like they're stripping... I mean, I know the games are more about gameplay, and I'm not saying they should sacrifice gameplay for story, no, but I think no. having a good story is, like, it, it helps. That's why I like it, but one of the reasons why I like uh, Unleashed and stuff so much is because the gameplay and the story are connected really well, and, you know, when, when you have, like, a a game that has a complete experience like that, I can make it more enjoyable in the long run, I find. Master Professor Pickle is big. No! Yeah. No. Whoa. What in the heck happened there? Hello? I, th I think your system got fucked up. Like, did you see? <laughs> yeah, I saw that. Uh, that was scary. <laughs> You're getting doxxed, Harry. <laughs> what was that? I have no idea. I'm just as confused as you are to my watcher. I hope something bad hasn't happened. My cat has graced me. How he bit me? Including myself. I still... Hey. Hi. I still won. <laughs> We're just talking about the Master Emerald and shit. Uh, yeah. Okay. Because... Okay, because um, Xavier just showed me a post saying that he's showing off um, Splatoon 2 Octoling hairstyles. Yeah. I'll, I'll say uh, one one thing about the Master Emerald thing. I can... That's how good you are. <laughs> I guess. I try. Uh, but like... The Master Emerald thing, I can kind of see, like, them not wanting to just, like, use that as a plot point over and over again, because, I guess, Yet, like, they still yeah. use the fucking Monster of the Week for, like, like, how many games? I mean, I guess, but at least you can, like, do different things with that. You can only really do, like, the Master Emerald uh, get stolen or shattered so many times. I mean, that's kind of why what? I liked Colors and Lost World, just because they kind of stopped using the Chaos Emerald plots. It, yeah, is this just yeah. 
Is it, is it talking about the Jinx Chaos and the Master Emerald in general? Uh, well, we're talking about how it affects, like, story and stuff and, like, Knuckles as a character. Well, it's like... Knuckles is supposed to be the Guardian, so... Yeah. What's going on? Yeah, but, like, my point is, like, you... Uh, it's like... For, like, a game... Uh, you can only really do so much with that concept, I feel. I feel like the comics yeah, also did a good job of covering this, because... Yeah, whatever yeah. Knuckles would need to go out and leave, he would have, like, the Chaotix or someone yeah. else look over it. Oh. Alright, oh, cause, yeah I, yeah, I can see what you mean. Yeah, I can I'm... see the Master Emerald's, uh, like, guarding thing working more for, like, a co the comic series and all that. Um, I was gonna say, like, I can see what you mean, though, because it's like, if it's just that it, it's, it's being the Guardian and all that with the sh shadow thing, it's eventually gonna just become redundant. Yeah. Mm, same with the Monster of the Week formula, but that didn't stop them until Colors. Well, I, I, I don't mind the Monster of the Week <laughs> At least, at stuff. least it's a different monster. Yeah, yeah and again, they, they, they can do whatever the hell they want in terms of, like, what the monster is. Yeah, but it was kind of getting, like, a supersonic fight at the end of each game was kind of getting redundant. I guess- It was I getting guess, pretty formulaic, in a sense. I guess because, I guess because, um, by the next game, you'd be like, like, say Colors, you'd be like, Alright, so what being a, what being a worldwide destruction is Eggman released this time? Yeah. And like, the, the, the game DS version started. did that. The DS version did that, but not- yeah. Oh, yeah, right, yeah, yeah the neg- the Nega Mother Whisper thing. Yeah. But, like, um... <laughs> Oh. <laughs> hey, it's a boat. <laughs> hey, Matt, I didn't know there was a boat in your home. Is that what you all Stricklings do? No. <laughs> but like, uh... Yeah, we just, have, we just have a boat in our house. Just um, have boats in our house. <laughs> Wait, why is there a boat in my house? Am I supposed to drive to school in it? <laughs> a boat's a boat, but the mystery box could be anything. It could even be a boat. Yeah. <laughs> but like... Oh. Uh, gen Generations kind of... <laughs> Kind of gave me the wrong impression, in a sense, because I, um, I assumed from Colors we were gonna have non-supersonic final boss, and then the next thing would be a supersonic boss, and like it would keep alternating. But we had Lost World and Forces back to back, and none of them had a supersonic fight, so I don't know. Forces you know, doesn't even Forces doesn't even have the Chaos Emeralds. Yeah, where the hell are those no, things? Doesn't. Like here's the thing, like I was kind of like, okay, where are the Chaos Emeralds? Because Colors. Had this had colors and Lost World had the, the red ring system, which yeah. the more you collected, you would get a chaos emerald by completing a challenge or some shit. So yeah. I thought, okay, in forces, if I do that, then I can get chaos emeralds, right? No. Nope. So get all the red rings. Didn't do that. So then I see that there are these numbered rings and then the silver moon uh, medals. Uh... So then I did those too, and they weren't there. So I'm like, what the fuck? Where are the chaos emeralds then? I. They're not there. I'm just like, what like, the fuck, guys? It's like, it's like, it's like, I think they focus a bit too much on the Phantom Ruby. Yeah, the Phantom Ruby was like the main thing. But like, it, 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 it pretty much but like, check it, all. Well, classic, well, classic really even, Classic and Mania needed the Chaos Emeralds to even come a chance against going against its power. Yeah, but like... And, uh, well, he has two other people with him this time. Yeah. That's the thing. Yeah, but like, uh... The thing is, like with uh, Colors in Lost World, it was they weren't part of the story, but they were at least like unlockable. Um, in Forces, the Chaos Emeralds just aren't there, period, and you have to unlock Supersonic through DLC, which is really, really weird. At least yeah. it's free DLC. At least it's free but, DLC. But they made yeah. Supersonic. Yeah. Supersonic is free. Yeah. What? Supersonic is free. Yeah. yeah. Well, it is now. They shouldn't have. They shouldn't have made him a fucking. Yeah. They shouldn't have made him pay DLC anyway because. No. It's a stupid idea. It's like. Yeah. Hey, I like that in Colors and Lost World you can unlock them, yeah. but it's like oh now you have to pay like two bucks for them. Oh yeah, wait, no, I, never mind. Because I say what you were about how long it takes to unlock Super Sonic in those games. At least they were in. He was in the base game. <laughs> At least he was there, but Ugh. don't talk. Don't talk to me about unlocking Super Sonic because once I again, like how... advanced, advanced trilogy, especially two. I've three. heard advanced. Yeah, yeah I've heard advanced. Advanced, is the advanced bad about trilogy that. was fucking. Well, not so much advanced three or even the first game. Just advanced two was fucking horrible with that. Yeah, yeah, you find <laughs> like in one run, and you need to get the 
And and you didn't even need to pass the special stage to begin with. Yeah, I'm good. And you had to do that four times. Like, why that, not that's... just do what the let's, why not just do what Advance One did and had it carry over between all four characters? 2D Sonic level design well, does not. Over aiming anyways. 2D Sonic level design is not designed around like trying to have like some kind of collector fun side thing. Like that's that. why I love the. That's why I love the hidden rings so much. And exploration because of for it. The thing is, those rings in um, Advance 2, you also need to take a very specific route. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And you need to, like, a um, decent amount of them. Because, like, in, like... Yeah, if you're gonna... If you're gonna do that, you, you... For... Say what you will, you would probably have to make your level design a bit more, like, um... CD. Yeah. yeah. But, like, is... Thing, Whereas like, backtracking is, is potentially possible in more, in more than one situation, and it's, it encourages exploration more. Because, like, what I've seen in, like, Advance 2... Is that how the hell are you supposed to backtrack for coin? Uh, the, the, the other you know, special Sometimes you can. That. Sometimes they'll lock you out from getting them. Like, that's why, that's, yeah, that's, that's why, that's why, why said, you um, would need characters like Tails or Cream to do that. Yeah. Not Sonic, but you have to get it anyway with him, because if you get it for Tails, the final story won't open. So, so you it's need just Son like, why not Sonic? just carry them over? The last game did you, that. You least, yeah, even Heroes did that. Yeah. And it was, well, yeah, heroes did that. They they carried over. Yeah, you I mean, need to get all the stages curves, were Garbage, but fuck, they carried over. Yeah, you, you only need yeah, you only need to get like an emerald once. Yeah, and it was easy with Team Rose because the levels were shorter. See, like, is she like? It's very possible to just get the emeralds in like the first like ten seconds if you can like if you can like do it right. I think in the PS2 yeah. version, you can pretty much. I think. I think you can theoretically uh, get the chaos emerald without it moving. Wow. I mean, I've, I've had. I have the GameCube version, and it's kind of tough to get a handle on that shit. Harry had to get. Harry get gave me the GameCube version. Yeah. I have the PS2 version on my PS3, and it's just, just to let you know. Slip, slip, slippery, slippery shenanigans aside, don't do it. Don't get the chaos emeralds with any team other than Team Rose. Well, try somewhere. to get them on your main playthrough. Just don't, I, just don't hunt them down with a. Uh... I can get most of them with Team Sonic with yeah. Kind of practice. Yeah. See, I, I, when I played the game, um, I tried What's to get the. Yeah. Sorry. I was, I was gonna say it's like don't just ignore the keys if you're yeah. haven't gotten an emerald yet. Yeah. I, 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 when I play the game, I, I try and get them as Team Sonic, and uh, I just try the stages again if I missed one with the other teams. And if you still can't get it, just get in the uh, side mode with, as Team Rose, probably. Yeah, pretty much. Yeah. Just don't do it's it with the... either Dark or Chaotix because you'll be there for fucking ever. I mean, well, Chaotix in some cases is really short. Dep it all depends on the level, obviously. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Like, sometimes it's even shorter than Team Rose. Mystic Mansion. Yeah. Team, team Dark is the one team I'm like, don't even try to get an Emerald Yeah, because that's, that's always going to be a long trip. I just always kind of found I... the whole getting hit and then losing the key to be a retarded thing. Like, okay. why not just... Like, you can robot. lose the key if you die, but why Why wouldn't you get hit? That doesn't make sense. Yeah. You keep the key if you have a barrier, if you have a shield. Yeah, you keep it if you have a shield. Yeah, you keep it if you have a shield. So, yeah. That's like a godsend. <laughs> yeah. Another reason why Team Rose is easier, because you get a barrier every time you use your Team Blast. This is the easiest mission ever. <laughs> hey, don't move. <laughs> you don't even have to do anything. You just gotta watch. I like how. Watch this, guys. You win. <laughs> I like how Dark Spine found this like way to soft lock the game, where like he was in handcuffs with Team Rose, um, and I think he, he like used one of those bumpers where you have to use a power character, and like they like send you flying. And he did that the, while the free, the free the free spring thing. Yeah, and he and he used a team team blast at the same time, and it just he it was just stuck in the animation. And it sort of looks the game. Where he was like caught in the in the spring oh. or something. Beautiful. So I hope this was a PS2. Uh, I think it was GameCube. <laughs> Hub, I have to tell you that I love your Dirt Free Sonic icon. Just look at it. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. that is amazing. So 
I'm, so doofy. I'm surprised Maddie hasn't made her picture. Um, hey, don't come near my emerald knuckles. Yeah, can we I just like talk movies. about how savage Knuckles was in that? Like, <laughs> Wait, in, in, I imagine every person like that when I'm near them. Does it get the fuck? I away love, I love Knuckles' like... face. It was the best thing. I, I, again, I, I want to see Knuckles do more like crazy stuff like that. <laughs> like just punch the crap out of things. Also, I was talking with Lewis. Um. The day that video came up, like, 20 minutes after that video came up. Yeah. And, uh, no what happened play. was, um, like, you, you could say, oh, Knuckles is being gullible again. But the thing is, at least he couldn't aim from our aim. We know, because we clearly saw Eggman in the cockpit. Yeah. <laughs> but, but from Knuckles' perspective, from where he was, from where he was. But how he would he can, really know? Because oh, like, 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 he's, he's seen... The, the tornado before and like the whole like tractor thing or whatever that comes with the tractor being yeah that weird thing no, the to no it's the tow it's like a tow truck yeah like he's he's see <laughs> he, he's seen that before in like Sonic 3 and all that so like you know you can't blame him for thinking it's actually Sonic this time I mean yeah. it's going back on the animations thing I think this I remember Tyson has saying that Knuckles was his favorite character, and you know what? Looking at that short, I can see. He definitely I... made. Yeah, I could see it because Knuckles gets like the best fucking facial expressions. Like in the Mania opening, after Sonic burst out of that big ring from Studiopolis, and he's like, "Ah!" I want the Mania Adventure shorts to be on the Plus game. Oh yeah, that'll be great. Because I think the I think that's a prequel to the Encore mode. I love um, the um, idea, 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 is. idea, idea, um, it, it, an idea to make the, uh, the gold medals in the special stages worth it, actually, is, like, get a certain amount of them, you get, then you unlock the shorts. Yo, Xavier, you getting the cool. <laughs> yeah. I mean, I already got all the gold medals, so if they keep, if, if they keep them, I can, I can like, have them automatically. I, I can put them down I completely forgot to go back and do those. Revenge is not an idea. Wait, you still you still don't have all the gold medals yet? No. Yeah. Oh, I, I I just got I I just couldn't do it uh, and I just I just the ended up the, just settling with the silvers. The the one that was the biggest pain in the ass for me was the one that was only like seven blue spheres. No, it was four. It was oh yeah, four. because you had to go you had to take a very specific path if you want to get if you want to get the rings and um. If you want to get all the rings and um, you can get it through, but even then, I feel like I'm, I feel like I did it wrong. Mm. Yeah, it took me. A, I had to look up what to do because I was just like, "What the fuck do I do? It's so short." Because, yeah. Yeah, because like there's like the path. There's like it's like a very narrow path with the, with the balls right in the way, but it feels like. But there's some points where it feels like uh, I've been to right at turns too. Yeah. Yeah. It's like yeah, turn around. It's like, it's like with the four spheres or four rings. For, I th it was like about one of the blue sphere stages. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Also, no, Xavier. We're, ta I think we're talking about the rings. I think yeah, it was we're talking about rings sixteen. I don't remember. I don't remember. We're talking about that one special stage in uh, Mania, the blue sphere one, where we had, where it was only like, a vi it was only like four blue spheres or, or oh, whatever. Oh, that small number. I mean, and game the perfect ass. <laughs> yeah. It was. I had to look up what to do, and most of them I didn't have that big of a, uh, have a, I didn't have a problem with most of them. It was just well, that and a few others were pain in the ass. Yeah, I didn't even bother with them. Right. For, for me, I figured, I figured it out on my own, but I can say it's like when I finally, when I got the gold medals on everything, it was, I felt Yeah, I got all the gold medals on my own. Mm. It was, it was satisfying when I finally figured out the patterns. Like, for some of them I felt like I, I felt like I knew it. So yeah. I, I feel like I could do it, I, and there was plenty of special stages. So I, so I. Uh, did you guys? You no, know, it just it's a matter of time eventually. Yeah. Did you yeah. go when you guys had to just grind for that? Did you just use debug mode? No. 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 no I, I, did, no, I just I just played the game. Well, I just kept playing the game because I was uh also trying to um you know I want I wanted to learn level design while I was at it. You know what, yeah, that I just, game's level design is damn sexy. For the I, 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 I just used the debug mode because I just wanted to get it over with. No, I, I, I should have done that. And I, yeah, I just wanted to focus on the special stages. I appreciate though that um, it, when if you don't ink, when you when you go for the rotation of special stages, assuming you got all the uh, special stages at least done, it'll rotate you for all the silver medals so you have more chances to get the golds. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. 
I don't yeah, know if it's possible to get all the pass in get all on. one pass, though. I doubt it. So, wait, hold on. So, uh, when you haven't finished, or when you haven't, like, gone at least a silver, um, for the, It'll uh, basically, uh, it'll basically, um, make sure, it'll basically keep letting you try to get the gold. Yeah, yeah. They'll, they'll keep cycling. So it won't make, so it won't let you do, like, the very first one, because, yeah. and, because then the gold medal will be pointless. Right, well, yeah, 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 I get that, but, like, um, does it, like, loop to the the ones you haven't done yet, or or the... the ones that you have the ones that you haven't done and the ones you um, haven't gotten the gold medals on yet. Okay, so it just loops loops both. Yeah. Once you get all the gold medals, I think it just picks them at random. Okay. Yeah. It does that. Oh my god, I have over. <coughs> at that point, you're pointless. Yeah. No, you're probably I'm just sick and tired of it. Cause you're just like, I had to do this one, like, fucking five I'm, times to get it. I'll be honest, I kinda wish there was a score, like, a score bonus when it's over. Yeah. Yeah. Cause, uh, cause, like, cause, like, it feels very anticlimactic, like, once you get the medal and then it just cuts back to the game. Yeah. yeah. I mean, even the Chaos Emeralds, uh, special stages, they give you a score bonus. Yeah. And then they have, like, the, the, the uh, blue, blue Sphere mode. <laughs> <laughs> that, I that, haven't that, beat I any do, of those like, new uh, ones, the Mania. Blue yeah, yeah, yeah I, I, like, at that point, I just got, I just got yeah, exhausted yeah. of Blue Spheres, so I just barely played point. it. I'm blue balling the Blue Spheres. Because <laughs> like, they're weird, like, they, they have a lot of weird new ones that, like, you have to... Yeah, and I still don't understand the them. purple ones. Yeah. And I still don't understand Pub. a good number of them. I think the purple Pub. ones are warped. Hub, it's funny you mentioned like blue balling the blue spears because there's actually a silver gotta rip up the blue spear song uh, where like it like one, like where where one second of the song just keeps repeating itself over and over. So here, you get the idea. Yeah. 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 It always it's the worst feeling when they start speeding up to like Mach four, like Mach five. You're just like fuck, yeah. I can't move. Yeah, 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 yeah. 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 Ludicrous speed, go! Ludicrous speed. Yeah. Go. Luke on the plaid. <laughs> so it's like Mach one is just like a daily stroll in the park. Mach two is jogging. Mach three is running. And then Mach 4 is what? like, oh shit, what? you're late for school, hurry up. And then yeah. Mach 5 is ludicrous speed. Yeah. <laughs> like, that's no, Mach 5 is shit. No, 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 no. Mach, no. Mach, huh? Mach 4 is that bit from, it, it plays that music from Ferris Bueller's Day Off when he's running. <laughs> like, <laughs> like, uh... The, the the speed screws me up in that the one that's like just a straight line you have to keep turning every now and then, uh, mm -hmm. like like it's not if you get fifty at all or a little too late or early, it, it becomes fucking precise. Yeah, because like it, it's it's annoying because like it it doesn't feel like hard at all, but like just the end bit just screws up. <laughs> Reminds me of that one special stage in um and in the when you're getting the super emeralds. And um, three. Yeah. Like, it's just a straight path, but but there's also points where um where like it wants you to turn inward and jump to grab rings. Oh, uh, that one. No time to lose. And then, but the thing is, while you're collecting the rings, that you're also really speed up. Yeah. Yeah. Because like, that was really weird for me, because I in Sonic Free uh Sonic Free Knuckles, um I always just followed the blue sphere path and never go to the rings. So like I feel felt... I do feel proud about one playthrough where I actually get did get all perfects. In Sonic Three. And Knuckles. Yeah. I just don't bother with that. It's not worth that, it. That felt that felt very satisfying. Mm. And Knuckles. It's a meme. But Knuckles is a meme. I love also that's how the what the Mania Adventures video is called. Yeah. yeah. yeah episode three and Knuckles. <laughs> <laughs> My boy should not. My mm. my boy should not I be. I expected no less, honestly. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> mega destruction. Mega destruction. Dark ball of darkness and destruction. And they're definitely. And they're like seriously hyping up some of them now. Like, what? Yeah. <laughs> what? They're doing. They're trying to hype something up in Metal Sonic. 
Yeah. Mm. Imagine, imagine if they called like episode. Imagine if they called the fourth episode like Sonic Man Adventures, episode four, episode one and two. Nice. <laughs> I mean, they called the third one for three and Knuckles. So. Yeah. <laughs> I love I, it, so, the Sonic and the Sonic and the uh, Mania. The Sonic team right. and the Mania team in general, they have really good humor. Yeah. It is time. When they know how to make their own I jokes. opened his, his, his hard drive to find 10 terabytes of selfies. Who does that? What is that from? Mm. Horses. See, uh, I, I don't oh. remember that line at all. No, I do, because of how line? stupid it was. When does that happen? What line? That happens, I think, before you start the Death Egg mission with Classic Sonic. Mm. Oh. That sounds more like, more like they would say, something they would say in Boom. Yeah, yeah seriously. That's, that's like... the problem. It's, it feels like a more like a Boom uh, series mm. joke rather than an actual main series when joke. Yeah, when they're a lot mm. more, like, modern, I guess, it feels mm. more like Boom. Yeah. It's yeah. weird, it's, it's weird, because they... The 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 modern games like it just it feels like they don't they they don't know what tone to go with like it constantly goes all over the place. Yeah, boom! At least it's consistent. Yeah, yeah. Is that just something that like Lost World is like the, the Lost World especially like story wise is like Lost World story goes everywhere and, and but goes nowhere. Yeah, but, like it's like. So you have all the all this like really cheesy cartoony like music and like it's like you have like these random lines that are meant to be like really dark, but then you also have like all this like like light-hearted cartoony stuff as well, and it's just it doesn't mesh well. Jarring. Right. The thing is, I think Sonic Team is trying to pander too much to both sides of the spectrum. Begin. The yeah. Classic Sonic yeah. and Modern yeah. Sonic. Yeah. Boom. I did see it. Yeah. I did see a uh, post Boom once. knows the demographic and it's sticking to it. Yeah. Like, yeah, we just had shit like, posters. Yeah. We just yeah. had the most uh, we just had the most awesome Eggman fight. It was a perfect mm. mix of classic tactics <laughs> and new robot. And too bad you missed it. That's what you get for following Knuckles all day. <laughs> 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 I love the movie right there so much. They need to make them. I, I, I will be shocked if they don't let them make another season. Yeah, yeah they, they need to make a third season. Yeah, yeah like, I haven't heard they, any about like, anything like, about say, it. Boom, like, the Boom games are probably not going to go anywhere from here on. But yeah. the cartoon, uh, you, especially within the Sonic fan base, you can definitely see how uh, how well it is. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Cause like I get the, cause like as far as I as far as I've seen, mm. the, in the fan base it actually does like the Boom cartoon a lot. Yeah. Mm. Well, cause it's shit post for it's, Sonic. It's, it's basically they just meta like, humor. They know what about. they want to do and they stick to it and they do it well. <laughs> it's basically yeah. meta humor for the series. Mm. Yeah. Yeah. The thing like, is, I you're probably you'll, you'll once... appreciate the jokes a lot more if you're a Sonic fan. Yeah. Mm. I saw a post once like, like, on Tumblr like, that who, said like, who, like, who, like, who dares that who dares disturb Necromatus? Viral sensation in the story of worlds. Viral sensation? You mean like that cute baby panda? Or all those weird pictures of me? <laughs> <laughs> I'm not Eggman, I'm Sonic. He's pretending to be Sonic again. Well I'm not gonna be Amy this time. <laughs> This meme is so five years old. A lot of people say I don't do a lot of guarding and shiny objects. Like this. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> well, uh, come on. I can't say I gotta go fast as an excuse this like, time. <laughs> like this the show is brilliant. Yeah. <laughs> and like, I don't even remember, like, I, 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 I gotta go fast. This is a medical condition. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, like, I, like, I'll consent to court, but I'm just gonna start on a leg day. day. Begin. Yeah. <laughs> leg day? Like, you, you, you like nature, right? That's what it says in my character description. <laughs> I think in um I think in Rise of Lyric or there's a line where Knuckles is like uh like I um something about like I I can't um something about cardio day. Skipping cardio day. I don't remember I don't remember any of the lines from the game. 
This isn't the end for you! Oh. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> How about we name our bad dude or two? Like That's too awesome sounding. We need something safe and inoffensive. Yeah. <laughs> Rainbow <laughs> Express? Ew. Ew. It's perfect. perfect. <laughs> I love that. Um, uh, but, but going back to the, uh, the is in the game for you, I love how that joke just starts. How it's like, how, like, they're talking for a moment, and Knuckles pats Sonic on the back really hard, and there's a ring fall out of him. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> It's like, that's the humor, like, we want. Yeah. <laughs> like, At least again, from like, Boom. Like... Yeah. Yeah, like... We had to... Sonic in, like... Like, modern... Or I guess, uh, like, normal. Sonic is a better way to say it. Yeah. It still needs to find what it wants to be. Yeah. Because I... I've, I even, like... Bring back, like, adventure... Or, like, Unleashed style writing. Uh, and like keep the like really over the top like cartoony stuff for Boom. But I mean like obviously make the um, if they bring back like Avengers style writing, obviously make it better for today's standards. But you know, like just the I general think the concept. Only, I think the, I, I've only had this kind of debate before, but I think Unleashed and to a smaller degree, um, colors and ha has the better balance for what for what normal should have. But don't you know you're supposed to hate Sonic Colors now because it killed the series? Where did that even come from? I don't know. It's just some retards or some shit. That, that goes back into the post I was talking about. What that I saw is like, let modern Sonic die, and I'm just like, no, no. How about you? Do so? No. And Whenever I, I see always... stuff, how about you put your put your dick in a fucking Cheerio box? Well, yeah. Well, when I, I, whenever I, I, I see I, stuff I, like this, like that, I'm just like. No, just go die and stick it. Mm. Like, then I saw all these reblogs that said bad post, original mm. post, bad post, bad post, terrible post, bad post. Let them both live in harmony. Bad post, OP. Mm. <laughs> as I stick on my, as I stick on my Protect Sonics T-shirt. Mm. You're not. No. Like, like, I'll, I'll be on. Like when Forces was coming out, mm. I was very. I said this before. Before before it came out, um, I was extremely worried because of how well Mania did. Yeah, yeah. Because mm. it, it might, if 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 forces bombed, then people are never gonna want the modern mm. kind of thing anymore. Big kind yeah. of gonna prove a classic. Also, point. Re, um, a quick quick mm. thing in the game itself right now. I like the fact that the corpses or whatever you wanna call it can still activate the boosters. <laughs> I mean, Forces, I think, sold pretty well, so it's clear well, that yeah, there's an audience well. for it. I mean, it, it's, it's clear there's an audience for Modern, it's just they need to well, I mean, figure out yeah. what they like, want to do. Reception, reception, reception like, why is it something else? But it did sell well. Yeah, mm. I thought it did pretty well. But like, And I think well, like, people need to actually realize that, that Sonic relies on the West to sell more than in Japan. And if that doesn't yeah. sell well, yeah. Sonic may freaking die. Like, Sonic may, like, be a dead franchise. It's kind of surprising yeah. how much Sonic has fallen uh, sometimes and still, like, been a thing. Like, it, no matter how hard he's fallen, he still had a dedicated fan base. Yeah. That's just the fan, just yeah. It's just yeah. the fan base is so divided. Like, and it's I yeah. mean, in some it's, ways... It's very divided, very... Because, like, I, I think I've said this before, but I think mm. with Sonic 3 and Knuckles, Sonic hit his peak way too early. Mm. It's just yeah. like Star Wars hit its peak way too early. Because yeah. when, you, when you hit your... When you hit your... Because, mm. like, this is the kind of thing I said about Ocarina of Time to, to, to a mm. degree. Like, when you hit your high point, your magnum opus, what, what everything else by comparison, they're gonna, it's going to be compared mm. to that. Mm. Well, I mean, obviously the modern games are completely different kinds of games, but... I mean, when the adventure games first focus. came out, they were critically loved. <laughs> mm. right. Right. Now, and nowadays then, like, it's a different story, but... Do yeah. you think that's because of, like, Shadow on 06 that they, that they were taking more, like... I think, hmm. I think, like, at that point... It, it's weird, because, like, I think at that point, like, like when we had, like... The fan base. Uh, the fan base. Because, like, when the SA1 and 2, like, re-releases came up for, like... 
uh, PS3 and all that. Nice the Adventure and... 1 what, for PS3 re release was pretty fucking terrible, though. Yeah. But I mean, like, but, but the Adventure 2 one was good, but the Adventure 1 one was well, pretty bad. Well, so the Adventure 2 also had also kind of. Well, both had well like what was the problem like what was the problem with the adventure one was it the uh, like the formatting on the video the game and all that it, for one it wasn't full screen at all so you oh yeah ugly ass barriers second the game got was even glitchier than the gamecube version because each version of sonic adventure just gets glitchier and glitchier every time mm. well i'm yeah, not gonna test that yeah. i have the ps3 version Aven of adventure and, and adventure 2 Aven is way better mm. Adventure, Adventure 2, 2 had, has worse sound editing on the PS3 yeah, version. Yeah, the game yeah, it's yeah. Not... But like, I'm, I'm, I'm but not the really. The game is like really good still. Yeah, but like, I'm not, I'm not really, I'm not really talking. I'm not really talking about like the boring job itself. But like, um, I get in terms of like just people in general. At that point, they have like all these other Sonic games to uh, look back on and like rethink how they feel about these games. I guess. Oh no. Well, then you I mean, have, again, like, uh, you have other kids as well. I was gonna say, like, if they re-released Heroes, it, oh. then, they, then like, another kind of, like, thing might come up. Heroes has always just been kind mm. of, a, like, a mm. mixed reception game. Like, some love it, some hate it. But there's, like, no, you get like, no general... Right? Yeah, I get what you're saying. I would... Yeah, like, I, well, I, I want something to... them to do something with, like, Heroes' is, like, gameplay style again. Cause like I'm thinking like um like like we're going into re into re-releasing re and like rethinking opinions. Yeah. Like um the cr like when we when we when we got the end Zane trilogy like did the game like did we like I came in thinking like it's gonna be just like the original, but I haven't played the original in some time so my uh I was like cause like there were points where I'm like is it this hard? I, I remember yeah, my experiences with the original. Some bits were more difficult, like the road to nowhere levels in the original. Yeah, were much well, harder. yeah, yeah. I, I know that levels the like uh, but levels to get gems in like Sunset Vista were way easier because of the the gem collection yeah. stimulation was See, yeah, fucking fixed. Think. See, like uh, yeah. like the insane trilogy is like oh. it, it's like it's obviously like on the like original double design all that, but like it feels mm. really different at the same time. It's hard to really compare the originals to it. Oh, you also yeah. have the more consistent controls thing because when you play yeah. Crash 2 and 3, they feel much better mm. than the original. Mm. I mean, Crash yeah. 2 and 3 are still more fun because Crash has an expand mm. the moveset, but yeah. in terms of just basic movement, he feels the same in all three games. Yeah, and uh, which, Crash... Which helps in... Which I guess can help and hinder in Crash One's case. Yeah, Crash One yes. is like it. It feels like it feels good in terms of like how Crash handles, but like it's not always designed around Crash One's level design. Right, because like I sometimes feel like because like Crash doesn't feel like he doesn't get as much because because he has momentum. It, yeah. Now. Yeah. Like some because like he let he didn't. Yeah. Cause like he kind of like builds up momentum, I guess, in Crash One, in the original Crash One, like normally. But like, yeah. if you like, if you be like, if you moved in the air, it'd be like if you're starting if you moved on the ground. Yeah. But like, uh... Cause, like, that's why Road to Nowhere and the High Road mm. were such big issues in the Insane trilogy. Oh god, the High Road! I'm getting non flashbacks yeah. now. Yeah, cause well, yeah, cause like in the Insane trilogy, like you drop so much faster than the original yeah. like, Crash One. So like you don't have as much time to think where you're landing, so you have to be like constantly on the ball, and it doesn't help get... the fact that like the collision to look detection is a lot more strict. Yeah, because of it, because it, it's now more relative to Crash's actual model. Yeah. Rather than rather than the rather than a box. Yeah, because like in the originals, like issue just great. The original, you pretty much tied up to Crash's shadow. Yeah, because in well, in the original, like when you. Uh, Jump on an like barely jumps on an enemy like the game will like just let you have that and like Take care of it in insane though. Sometimes that will just make you that that will mean you get hit instead Right and um, Nerds! 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 We grew up with this stuff It's sad not to notice it when you play the original so much 
Can Nerd. someone insert that fucking uh, TFS clip of, of like Piccolo and Napoli saying that? Yeah. No. No. Yeah. The very first thing I think of is Revenge of the Nerd. No. I think of Homer saying that, and like Homer goes to college, like a nerd walks <laughs> by. He's like, Nerd. Nerd. <laughs> Anyway, yeah. I will um, I will say this about like Crash, like from what I've like seen and heard, like the fan base seems pretty trash to be honest, because like all they really do is like complain about like really minuscule things, and they don't really seem like they want Crash to evolve. Hey, like, it's Star Wars all over again. St oh, did you mean the Sonic fan base? Uh, uh, so Sonic oh, fan base, the Sonic fan base is a godsend in comparison because, like, you know, say what you will, but like, like every fan base has like a toxic side. I'd say the Sonic fan base has kind of improved, if only because yeah. the fan game scene has just been so much more expansive in the last few years. Yeah, because like, you have people making their own 3D engines, and I'm very impressed. Yeah, because like, like, damn, the, Sonic fans have talent. Here's the thing, like with Sonic, like. Part, I, part of the reason, I guess, why, like, the vocal minority is, like, is, like, a lot larger than, like, most other fan, like, fan bases, be just, just because, like, Sonic's been around for so long, and it's, like, like, just in general, when you have a series out for, like, 25-something years, that just ends up happening, and, like, that toxic side just becomes more obvious. Hey, Harry, you just described every fucking superhero fan base right there. Nice. But like, I'm looking at I'm looking at you, R slash Spider Man. Yeah. Christ. But like, and I, say what you about like the Sonic about Sonic fans do, but like, at least they can form their own opinions, and uh, you know, all and not send death threats about it to to other people who have different opinions. Because like, there 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 are that's like, what the kids do. Like there right? are there there the are like. Do. There are like fans, like those kinds of like childish fans in the Sonic fandom, but it's like that's a lot less than people make it out to be, and like people generally just seem to focus on that one side when there's like, you know, like you were saying, Hub, about how people been making like a lot of like, these fan games and stuff, and all, yeah, you know, yeah, just making a lot of stuff and helping the community grow, where it's like. The Crash fan base doesn't really oh. like to see anything different besides one, two, and one, three. One, two, or three. And the whole like maybe Twin Sanity. Yeah, like they they just see like a linear oh. platform advent like platform kind of game, oh. and they don't really want to. Hold on, uh, like they don't really want to see the series evolve oh. from that, and like anything. Even. Thank you, God. Uh, I, I, yeah, I, I'm, all, I'm almost done. But like, it's like, it's that. It's not even just that, but it's also just the fact that the fan base itself just doesn't really do anything healthy. Like besides just like complaining about the most trivial things that don't really matter, and you know they don't really contribute to anything. Like they don't. It's not like the Sonic fan base where they at least make. Like fan art, comics, fan games, and all this other stuff. Like the Crash fan base just do nothing. <laughs> that, that's what yeah. I was gonna say next. Like the whole fan art and fan comics, like for forces. I saw like these whole what if scenarios and stuff that'll make you actually cry. Like my favorite one will always be like like a re a re imagine Infinite versus Silver. And infinite, yeah. like he turns around and he's like, "Who dares question my power?" And here comes Silver. Yeah. He's all glowing and shit. And he's like, "My name is Silver. I'm sorry, but I'm here to kick your butt." <laughs> and I'm like, "Yes!" Yeah. Super Saiyan Rage Silver. But yeah, it's like <laughs> Rage Silver. Did you say? Because I, I Super Saiyan uh, Rage. That was like a transformation in Super. It was really weird. Like they didn't really explain it. It was basically just like imagine Super Saiyan two. With a little bit of like Super Saiyan God Super Saiyan power, because it was just that. I hate like that game. Super Saiyan I hate that game. Yeah. What? Super Saiyan, Super Saiyan God. God Super Saiyan. What well, is called? Super Saiyan Blue. That's Dreamboat the Express. I hate that. That's just, that sounds like a me. Like I, I don't even know. Like. <laughs>
It's like... Oh, no, oh. Yeah, it does kind of sound like a meme. Sonic has red eyes. Yeah, it sounds like just the horrible, like, joke someone made. The word is stupid, that's what it is. Yeah. I mean, we like, had, a uh, We had, a uh, Super Saiyan God, then we had Super Saiyan Rose, which is amazing, by the way. What? Hmm. Super Saiyan Rose, it was like... Pink. <laughs> what is it like? Is it like Super Saiyan God? It's, uh, imagine a god obtaining a Super Saiyan power. Ima it's, imagine a god version of Super Saiyan Blue. Like, an even more god that, version, that, that I guess. That's redundant. Mm. Yeah, no. But it's only, it only one character used it, so it's just exclusive to him. Because he himself made it. Was it Goku Black? Yeah. Goku Black? Yeah. Why does Goku, Goku Black exist? In a very convoluted story arc in Dragon Ball Super. Is it is it like Dark Sonic? No. <laughs> because no, that's what I think of when like I hear that. it. Well, Dark Sonic was is was extremely well off. Mm, yeah. Not as cool as Dark Spine though. Dark Spine Sonic is actually one of my favorites. Dark Spine is cool. Dark Spine I love. This is your world. I don't want to be a part of it. Dark Sonic <laughs> is, comes out of nowhere oh. and it doesn't really amount to anything. Like, I can understand the negative effects of the Chaos Emeralds, like, taking its toll on you, but yeah. Darkest Spine will always be my favorite, because, yeah. as I've pointed out before, probably, if you pay attention to that cutscene with the rings and, like, how he names them, like, about five or so go into him, and three, which represent negative emotions, go into Sonic, and that is why he goes all sad and Dark Spine-ish. Yeah, but, like... Uh, no, it's annoying in Sonic X's case because it's like, mm. it's like they in, like they introduce a dark Sonic thing, but they don't do anything with it. Yeah. Like, yeah, this is the thing that happens. Get over it. Eat your porridge. Yeah. yeah. Oh god. Just, you know what? Talk about that. I, I would I thing. would prefer the, the the Sonic the comic take on Super Sonic when he has the evil energy from it. Or is just a psychotic monster. Oh yeah, like, he just wants to murder everyone. Is that yeah. when, isn't that basically like what um like somebody who can't control Super Saiyan would do? It would be like kind of. Yeah, kind of. It's like Goku was pissed the first time he went Super Saiyan. Well, because Freeza killed Krillin. Yeah, that's that's why the Super Saiyan was supposed to have red eyes. But like, and the fact that he can keep any though. kind of control on himself on Vegeta, or sorry, on Frieza, was is surprising enough, I guess. But that's why they were supposed to have right? red eyes, because in the original yeah. page of the of Dragon Ball Z, Oh come on, Bush should have died there. They, they went with green because I don't know it was a color palette, I guess. But Supersonic. <laughs> I always saw figures. the green eyes as being sort of like mystic or sure some shit. Yeah. They're really pretty though. They're, they're kind of pretty. <laughs> well, you would say that. <laughs> yeah. Yes, and only I would say that because I'm a girl and I, I'm a woman and I have taste. <laughs> oh man. Only women know <laughs> exquisite taste. <laughs> wow, Rex is flying that's all that's over that's the place. Oh, biscuit. <laughs> what? I'm watching the, the the gameplay footage. It's just okay. When you say Rex, I I, I think of um, Xenoblade Two. Yeah. No, the dinosaur toy Rex, the one that needed to get the fucking Buzz Lightyear at your strategy guide. Hey, Buzz! <laughs> we, uh, hit. No, no, no! Buzz! I have exclusive. Where did you get what I was referencing? <laughs> toy Story Two. Yeah. I still love, like, one of my favorite scenes in Toy Story 2 is when Buzz meets the fucking toy, uh, the other toy Buzz Lightyear, and he's just like, I'm not doing this shit again. Yeah. Yeah. I, don't yeah, I like how he, like, just, like, just the button on the helmet, and he's like, yeah, I know this. <laughs> yeah, it's like he's been here before. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, yeah, He yeah, just, yeah. like, <laughs> I just like how he just walks out, he's like, I don't have time for this. <laughs> yeah. It's like, which one's the real you, stick your leg up? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's just like, it's like, okay, now that he's out of the way, here. <laughs> you mean the little light bulb that blinks? Somebody shooting a laser at me! Go away! Go away! Uh, no! I'm I'm do something about that! 
Or you can go and run off and do something else. As your AI depicts you to. God, the AI in Andromeda is even worse than the AI in the original Mass Effect trilogy. Well, this guy's fading through a so box! I have the street, so I have the Street okay, Fighter anniversary roll. collection. It's pretty fun, but, I, but I, I'm probably not going to play online Thanks, because I feel like I'm going to get dominated. <laughs> yeah, um, that's the problem I have with fighting games. It was, with most fighting games aren't Smash. I know, like, with, especially with, like, art, with, like, traditional arcade fighters, like, that are more, or, like, nice, that, more nice. combat, or, like, I guess, to, I guess not traditional, but say something like, um, Marvel's Capcom, I know I'm going to get destroyed the moment I try. Yeah. You know what? I played Dragon Ball Fighters this morning and I got my shit caved in. <laughs> I'd probably just go on there just for lols. I mean, I love Dragon Ball Fighters, but fuck, man, it was it was rough this morning. I was like, shit, why am I getting my shit caved in today? <laughs> at least with Smash Bros, I have. At least with Smash Bros, I know I know exactly what I'm doing. Yeah. Mhm. Mm yeah, with Smash Bros, I know exactly what I'm doing. For, especially for especially some of the characters that I that I usually use. yeah. Uh, Whereas everybody uh, you, uh, you can theoretically at least beat anybody with anybody. Yeah. Uh, Whereas with, with, with traditional fighting games, I, all I do is just like mash buttons and hope for the best. If you're not using if you're not using yeah, like in every game like Marvel's Capcom, it'd be like if you're not if you're not using um Virgil, what's wrong with you? Oh. Or Dante or Doom. Or fucking Magneto, or Wolverine, or whichever game. No, yeah, that's exactly zero. what I mean. Though it's like if you, it, you it's like you have to. It's like it's like with the it's like the problem I have of like if I ever get in the melee competitively, it's like I have to probably use somebody like Fox if I, if I want to say a chance. Mm -hmm. So yeah, so oh, it's what? like in like Ultimate Marvel vs. Wow. Capcom Three, you're gonna see Zero, Dante, Virgil, Doctor Fucking Doom, and his goddamn foot dive, which girls like <laughs> for some reason. Six, girls six, six, love six, them foot out real dives. Fast. Girls love them foot dives. Eh, nah. okay, I prefer wait, I robots. Anyway. On the opposite, I like it. At least, I like um, going back to like collection stuff. I also have the Mega Man Legacy collection now. Mm -hmm. You're doing yourself Bye. a huge favor. I cannot yeah. wait for the delicious X collection to come out. Mm. Well, when is that coming out? Let's come out in July, I believe. Yeah, the X like oh, my birth month. Oh, wait, yeah. Sonic Mania Plus is also coming out in July. Oh shit. Yeah, it's coming out on my birthday. Yo, E3 is July like 17th in a week. Is my birthday. Yeah, and like I'm, I'm probably, I'm most likely gonna be at, I'm gonna be at work for the entire thing, so I won't be able to watch. Like, I, I, know, I won't be able to watch Nintendo's conference live while I'm working. Mm. But, like, When's but Nintendo's I, conference? I, it's, I think June 12th. I know it's, and I believe it's, like, in the morning. I think, like, it's, it's like... Oh, my God, E3's... Uh, yeah, I, I'm, gonna I, be at, I'm gonna be at school, at school that day. Yeah, I'm Wait, gonna be working, so I'm... Yeah, I'm gonna yeah, be Jason. at school that day, so I can't watch it. Yeah, yeah Jason, what were you gonna say? I can't believe how close we are to E3. Yeah, I was just saying, yeah. like, it's like in a week. Ooh. Why am I sliding? Because like, I'm, 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 for one thing, it's gonna we're gonna see the Invitational for Smash Bros. Smash. Oh, oh, they they get it, they, Yeah, we're gonna see like, it's like yeah. what Smash Switch actually is. Oh, we are definitely gonna be. We're definitely all need to watch that. Yeah. What time is that happening? Scary plot, to no be honest. The one thing, now it's just kind of a scary plot for some reason. Yeah, I mean, I'm planning like when my I, I don't know if I would uh, stream Mania Plus. Maybe I would, because I know I'm gonna stream my first playthroughs of Mega Man X6 and X7. Yeah. I just oh, have, I'm I gonna be there comfort. so I can cry. Yeah, I need I need you to, so to comfort cry. me because I would probably kill myself. <laughs> if I were on my like own. Maddie. It's like Maddie. I need, I need, I need you to. I, 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 need, I, need, I, I need, I need emotional support. <laughs> I'm gonna yeah. sit there and I'm gonna when laugh and I'm gonna cry. Oh my god! Yeah. <laughs> I need just emotional because you put, support. <laughs> just because you put zero in the game doesn't mean zero's gonna fucking save the game. I get it. He's a fat ass with really long, pretty hair, but that doesn't mean he's gonna save the game. I'm sorry. A a what you mean to say is I love zero, says Maddie. <laughs> I, I, I do. I, I do. I do. What I Maddie do. is now saying is fuck you, Jason. 
<laughs> you must really like her, dude. We're friends. We're nothing but friends. Sure. <laughs> we are! Okay, okay. I'm just getting around. Has no, Luna for no, like... No, what, has, it, has it been... Has it, has it, I think it's almost been five... Is it, I think it's almost been five years. Dude, wow. they... Uh, they... <laughs> They're, 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 <laughs> they'd be like, a, like, okay, friends. Maddie would just like kill Jason ten times every day if they were actually in a relationship like that. Okay. Don't even, don't yeah. even talk and like that, please. You know what? I always did it see Matt. I always saw Matt as the dominant one. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. She, she has the, she has the personality of. Of dominance, she's like, okay, hon, you're gonna do this. No, what'd you say? Uh, okay. <laughs> what you say, bitch? She just, she just inherits, she just inherits Sapphire's personality. Hmm. Yeah, I just inherited one of my own character's personality traits. <laughs> you guys kept talking over each other, so I put what I wanted to say in the chat. Go okay. ahead. I need OBS working. Yeah, I will yeah, buy yeah. Kirby's Dream Collection. Yeah. I don't think I have the Dream Collection. No, I, I don't. Got it. I don't I have got it either. I got it. That anime ball. Mm. What games does it have? Yeah. Um, uh, Kirby's Dreamland One, Adventure, Superstar, Dreamland Two, Dreamland Three, Kirby Sixty Four. I already, oh, I've already talked about my distaste to this. Like, uh, like, uh, and, and, and like, and you can also watch a, you can also watch a. A few episodes. You can also watch <coughs> several episodes of the, of the of the anime, and there are new challenge mode stages. Oh, Wait, man. what was the anime on it? Yeah, yeah, there are. yeah. There, yeah, there are episodes of Right Back you on the disc. Please tell me we like, have the fucking animation one, but they they make like their animation. Dee dee that's the name you should know. No, that's the one. Aww, bullshit. The pilot's one of them. I'm gonna yeah, just. The Gone. Um, there are, there are, there are three episodes, obviously, like, the, uh, the first episode, obviously, is there, and then the other episodes are Crusade for the Blade and Waddle While You Work. Is Waddle While You Work the one where the Waddle Dees and the Woos were or some shit because their food gets cut or some shit? <laughs> no. Their food gets no, cut no, like, or some D -D 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 shit? No, sells off the, D -D -D sells off the Waddle Dees so that, to pay, to pay off a, to, to pay off a hefty loan deal, Nightmare Enterprises. Oh, okay. Oh, you mean he owes Dan long. Green? Oh. He owes Dan Green money. Nice. Yep, essentially. Like, but, be but, be but because he sold off all the Waddle Dees, he can't afford to... Like, he, he doesn't know how to do anything for himself. Yeah. Like, he, he, he doesn't know how to do yeah, anything Friday's for himself. Yeah, Cargoon doesn't know anything either. <laughs> yeah, yeah he, could, he couldn't do anything for himself, so, like, he got desperately hungry. To the point where he almost... The point where he almost ate Dina, one of Dina Blade's babies, and, me, and oh my yeah. god, and rightfully, and rightfully so, she was angry. Yeah. Um. What? Why are you talking about like episodes on the uh, anniversary collection? And that was uh, Dream Collection. That reminds me. I think with the um, Mega Man, the Mega Man anniversary collections, they had like a GameCube version, an Xbox version, a PS2 version. I think. And yeah. I think each one had their own cartoon. Hmm. Oh really? Like, yeah, I think one of one of them had the Ruby Spears cartoon. One of them was, I think, NT Warrior. And Hold oh, on, shit, I, I have the. I have at this, the at this point, the anniversary at, at, at this point, I'm just gonna see if I can just. Okay, uh, PS2 MLA has the Ruby Spears cartoon. The GameCube version has an interview with Keiji and Afune, and the Xbox version has uh, the first oh, episode. Oh, hey, it has the. It has the. It's the same interview from the GameCube version, but it also has the first episode of NT Warrior, which was garbage, by the way. Uh, um, I was a different. Mad, what are you, what are you going about? The fucking movie Spears cartoon is fucking Mega Man. Fighting robot. Mega Man. You know yeah. what? That cartoon is pretty good on an entertainment level, but it's a pretty fucking terrible adaptation. I just, I just love her. Someone made an like, edit for oh the, uh, someone made an yeah. edit for the intro, where they just like had the guy yelling "Super Fighting Robot Mega Man" from the <laughs> Invitational in it. Oh yeah, I love that. <laughs> 
I, I, that, was, I, I, that was the most hype moment from that invitation. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> that's, well, that's the one that we all of, wanted to see during yeah. that time. Speaking of um, cartoon adaptations, once again, I have some very favorite episodes from Sonic X, but my favorite one will always be that one episode where Sonic meets that girl in a wheelchair and she wants oh, to go to this one. place. Yeah. Where, where it's oh, full yeah, of yeah, flowers, yeah. and I'm like, that's good! That's what 06 should have been! Yeah. Like, nope. You know what? My favorite episode of X was the one where Sonic gets that weird chip in his ear and he can't stop running. Oh, that was funny. Oh, yeah, that I was, remember that one. Yeah. <laughs> my favorite moment was when he, he's in the fucking hamster wheel and he runs over Knuckles. <laughs> I love I love their little schematics. Like it's funny, like a like a Sly Cooper scheme. <laughs> yeah. Oh man. My favorite episode where he got stuck on the boat. Where he got stuck on the boat. And he was like doing like all these convincing like tricksy little Please, ways yeah, to yeah, get off the like, boat. To get away with the elderly, I think. <laughs> Finally it's finishing really, like, up Amy, some characters he, now. He's just like in the corner and he just yeah, looks at the camera yeah, and just has the smirk on his face. You know, I, I also <laughs> love the moment where she pep talks Sonic. He walks a bit and he goes into a fetal position. <laughs> <laughs> have you, have you seen the Japanese the version of that? Have you seen the Japanese version of that? It's like oh, you are the main better. character you have to do ratings. <laughs> You were you the most important. Like, just out of a boat where you can't run around for a bit. In Japanese. Huh? Yes. Funny. <laughs> that the. Uh... Oh. <laughs> that episode where Sonic's on a boat. Yeah, yeah. I've been through just going to like uh. I, I forget what the re even reason was. Just to do in there. Filler. And as, yeah. yeah. As as, like, as everyone will the... say that the it, the SA two arc. I'm really finished that it's like, I think Chris handled that situation for the SA2 arc better than Amy did, because Amy was just there in the game, where Chris, he's a human. Chris Van works in the pep talk chat and the helping out. Yeah. yeah. And just that, like, oh, yeah, like, oh my god, he actually cried, what the actual fuck shadow has emotions! <laughs> emotions! I mean, he does shed a tear in SA2 as well. Yeah. Granted, it looks pretty shitty in that game, but yeah. Well, I mean, like, yeah, but like, technology at the time. Yeah. It's, it's like, it's like you see him as this badass who's like, like, revenge against humans because of death for Maria, and then he just realizes and he's like, oh, oh, oh fuck. Revenge! <laughs> the, oh, the, sick! My favorite part. Turns out, turns out revenge wasn't, I... turns out Maria wouldn't want revenge. She actually wanted flowers. Yeah. <laughs> flowers! <laughs> flowers! Okay. Make, uh, all make all the flowers! No, the make them all! Yeah. You know what, I want, I want fucking Thanar of Shadow's secret hobby of him being a flower My duty tender. is to save the flower. Like, he just knows about flowers, I'm like, why yes, do you know pretty that? Much. Cause cream, I don't know. Cause yeah, cream, cause cream. Yeah. The six-year-old rabbit told me. Yeah. yeah. Yep, of, of the course. Cute rabbit can do it. Of, 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 course, of, of course, Shadow is friends with Cream the Rabbit because you're a fucking you're monster. Cream, you're not you're the rabbit. rabbit. You're not your monster. Yeah, you're a monster if you're not friends with Cream the Rabbit. That's why I made all my Sonic OCs friends with Cream the Rabbit. I Ruby mean, I, I can kind of, I can kind of I mean, see like. Way. I mean, Cream is just cream. too, Cream is just too adorable to hate. I, and I can kind of, I, I can kind of see like Shadow seeing a bit of Maria and Cream as well. Yeah. 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 He becomes her surrogate father. <laughs> <laughs> I, saw, I saw a comic, a fan comic of like, Shadow being a dad to Cream, and he's like, okay, so what happens if someone tries to bully her, and Cream's like, you put him in a chill call, and then you kill them, and then Vanilla just sits just like, anybody bull anybody, anybody bullies Cream, Shadow just get, Shadow gets like, the, uh, one of the weapons from the Shadow crate, <laughs> that points right at their head. Huh. <laughs> <laughs> hey, my hair. No, I imagine I Shadow, like his favorite fucking thing to do is not chaos powers, but karate chopping action. <laughs> <laughs> chaos <laughs> control does the sweeping kick the, like, like he did the silver in 06. Yeah. Yeah. Karate chop action. <laughs> karate <laughs> chop action, not... Karate chop <laughs> action! Yeah. I still love, I, I still like the bit in, um, like, I still like the bit in... <gasps> I disconnected! 
Uh, I still like the bit in LEGO Dimensions where like Shadow gets the gun, but then like Knuckles just like grabs, <laughs> grabs it, off, it and throws it away. And Speed. the best part yeah. is that he actually takes off his glove. Is that he actually takes off his glove so his so with so his, because it's like because his leg his Lego model basically means he has he's wearing he wears gloves underneath his gloves. Uh, also, <laughs> ra 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 ran random thing about the Karate Chop action thing. Uh, I have like a Buzz Lightyear. A figure, and me and my brother used to keep on trying to press the back button so it would do karate chop action, and then we always got sad because it never works. Not oh. if oh. Poor Harry. Poor, poor Harry. Oh. No. Not a flying oh. toy. Oh. You're really in no more. Don't mind me doing that. Or don't mind me, I'm waiting fit. I'm reading fan fiction. Jason City Beast. Yeah. I'll be right back. Okay. Anyways, um, I was talking about like, uh, cartoon adaptations now and all that. Mm -hmm. video game. Uh, how about that Donkey Kong cartoon? Yo, um, what's one something? Uh, I would just say, one thing I find hilarious the uh, website I watch has the. I mean, it has a DKC cartoon in there, but the, the picture they use is the box art of Donkey Kong Country Returns! <laughs> and it makes no sense, but it's hilarious! Oh hey, yo! Duh. Here we go, banana slammer! You get right. Diddy Kong! Wait, what am I doing? This is a tournament. I didn't oh, even oh, wait, what's this? Oh, is an event gonna go? Is an event going on? For I want a nice, clean fight. Yeah, I don't really care about it because my game hasn't updated for a week. Make it rain. Okay, wait. Okay. Hollywood red carpet cosplay walk in Los Angeles. Yeah. I'm trying to eat some cake because I'm hungry. Awesome. Mmm, tea cake. Yum. <laughs> You will also be able to Donkey Kong cartoon. The thing and, and the songs were, were the best part, first of all. Oh, I you think you they Donkey Kong, Kong actually sang really well. Ah. <laughs> one of my favorite, um, one of my favorite videos though was um of the uh, the metalhead song from the from, from the uh, episode where um Donkey Kong's brain got switched into a robot. Don't ask. Uh, <laughs> But because like it was during, during the metalhead song, there's a video, there's a version of it where somebody just literally edits out every single time Diddy sings. Uh, oh yeah, yeah. <laughs> it was called um, I think it was called Metalhead Good version. Well, <laughs> that is hilarious. I'm not scrapping. Uh, it's it's Lewis. Really, uh, you would so, for a second. Oh. Just for a moment. Oh my god. Maybe it's the microphone. I Lewis. Oh. L Lewis, I just said your name and my little sister's calling out for you. <laughs> What's your name? Hey. Hey, What's who am I talking to? I'm talking to I'm talking to Lewis. I'm talking to Harry. I'm talking to Hub and I'm talking to Jason and Xavier. Can you say Lewis? <laughs> no, she's not gonna say it now. <laughs> no, you can't have a donut! <laughs> oh my goodness. You have to ask Ted! <laughs> you said you show up! That is adorable. That is adorable. Oh yeah, I forgot. Today is the 10th anniversary of Loss. Yeah. Oh, really? Remember that fucking meme oh. comic? Oh, yeah, one. Ah. Come on, Will! Uh, I'm Scrappy. Oh, no. Harry, why are we doing Sparrow 2? Oh, good leveling and I need a healer. <laughs> Hold on, I'm gonna get you a donut. Calm down. Oh, uh, ten power de- uh, oh, this is kind of bad. Another one for Let's do this. There you go. Oh, shit. 
Uh, I'll bring it back. <coughs> 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 oh, good. Somebody's new to this team. Oh god, I got a very easy dungeon for my level one. I'm, I, I was so scared I was gonna get, um, Orin Veil again. <laughs> you enjoying that donut, Lil? Donuts are delicious, but I can't have that many. <coughs> or more like I don't have many donuts. Do you like jelly filled donuts? Oh, fuck those. <laughs> That was a terrible joke. You should feel bad for it. I don't like jelly filled donuts. Like, I just put <coughs> glazed donuts above all. I'm making a Pokemon joke. <coughs> yeah, I know what you're referencing. That was so dumb. It was dumb. It, it's killing Mads right now. <laughs> wow. <coughs> Thanks. He ran right by the friggin'. Somehow I didn't notice him. Also, another favorite episode of Sonic X that I like. I don't actually remember what the context what the was, but oh, the baseball episode was great. But um, oh yeah, it was the one where it was the one where Cream yeah. for a moment. No, because we came out just. And creeps like easier to power the door. I was like, please go, please go, me, Mr. Robot. Something worth it. You know what? If I were writing that, I'd just have the robot throw a fucking ball in Creep's face and just knock her out. Don't do that to, don't do that to the cute child. Thank you, Mr. Pitcher. Yeah. Um. By the way, um, Maddie, I can definitely tell we got a new. I can definitely tell we have a new tank. Watch out. Mm. Okay, I'm, I don't really care right now, don't, just please don't talk to me about Final Fantasy XIV, please. You can talk to me about yourself! Talk, okay, talk about it to talk. yourself, yeah, just don't yeah, I'm, not, I'm not in a okay, mood for okay, this. Okay. Um, the baseball episode, though, was on Sonic That was, that was, that was, that was, that was my first episode of Sonic X, and as a oh, six-year-old really? kid, I was really fucking confused. Huh? I was like, what the fuck is this? <laughs> I remember seeing an advertisement for Sonic X, and then I saw the baseball episode, and I, I thought remember. it was a fuck. Fucking... Fuck this. <laughs> yeah, I don't remember. I don't remember the the context for it, but I think it's um. There's I think these were creams. Um, like, it, in a baseball stadium that, uh, and um, I think Kale was like becoming friends with the uh, guy who owned the place. Yeah. Uh, yeah. yeah. Yeah, but, and it didn't want him um, to file the battle, and Tails didn't want him to file the <clears throat> Eggman to file the battleground with a battle, so they decided, so he convinced them to like, do a baseball game. Yeah. Tails, advocate. <laughs> Tails, baseball rights activist. So I, I think, because I think what was going on was the stadium was going, it was about to like get demolished soon, but the, but the game between Sonic and Eggman, um, was um. Was like attracting yep. crowds to get the place going. <coughs> <coughs> but um, but, um this um, episode. Oh, oh. Knuckles originally didn't want a part of it, but then they like teased Knuckles into, into it, basically. And then he just became, and he was basically just hitting home runs every single time. He looked so cocky about it. I love <laughs> cocky Knuckles. But anyway, um, this episode that I'm thinking of, it's where um, I don't, I think it's when Cream is like trying to be friends with Chris and he just hasn't got the time for her or anything and so she's making flower crowns and is running out of flowers and then she turns to the window and Sonic's in a tree <laughs> he's just in a tree with all these flowers and is motioning her to go out the front and that's the only context of that episode that I actually remember yeah. Sonic, secret flower boy yeah. to be fair to Sonic X also, um, it also gave Cream one of her most badass moments that whole emerald Emerald yeah, arc, like, oh, yeah. my feels, my feels, my feelings. 
Oh, I could- I should- I should find and download all of Sonic X just so I can watch it and cry again like I'm doing in Ninja Turtles 2003 right now. What moments make you cry in that show? Don't, don't, uh, don't say too much, by the way, Maddie, because I'm only in, um, I'm only at season two. No, she's talking oh, okay. about 2003. Well, let's, let's, okay, yeah, don't, don't say anything else. Wait, 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 wait. <laughs> That's 2012. I'm talking about 2003. Yeah, yeah, I was gonna uh, say. Yeah. Okay, I won't say too much about any of them, any of those series, because everybody needs to watch them because they're good. Yes, I think Four yes. Kids is great, and two, 2012 is great too. Well, if you want some, great anyways. If you want some cheese, then I recommend. If you want a good time, go watch the 80s show. <laughs> But don't I don't think that show has <laughs> held up all that well in some aspects. Is she, animation wise, well, it's horrible. What do you, you want to go on the fridge for? If you want like a, an ongoing like storyline uh, with like all these different like plot points and stuff, it, don't, um, don't expect that much from uh, the 80s one. No. But the sources are but, being um, really nice to me today. Um... The gods smile upon you, Harry. Yeah, I should, I should re- I should, like, buy and download all of Sonic X just so I can watch it again. Namely because I want to cry, yeah. and mostly because the Menorex Saga has the most feels, and I also want to cry some more. Menorex Please let me cry. Basta! <laughs> <laughs> that- that whole scene... That whole scene where, Ta mm. where Tails has to shoot her, it's even more painful in the Japanese version. Like, way it's, worse. That's why Japanese voice acting is intense. It doesn't, yeah, it, the, the uh, emotional impact isn't really there a lot in the 4 kids one. Oh, it's yeah. fucking... Unless you, like, unless you count the SA2. Uh, unless you count the SA2 arc, because I actually cried in the English version of that, I'm like, oh. Okay. Mm. I don't need my heart anyway, take it. Take it. I don't need it. Take it, Shadow, take it. I don't need it. Take it. <laughs> I refuse to play. Um, <laughs> oh, this is the really annoying collection, Sean. If you have to, like, balance on a rail or whatever. <clears throat> like, oh, dear. Yeah, what more feels? Play the, Me play the Mega Man Zero series. God, that, that shit's yeah. full of feelings. Whoa. Yeah, stuff the ending this. of Mega Man Zero is feels. Oh, so many feels. What a nice Oh. I am the Messiah. No, you're fucking not. <laughs> I'm gonna kill you. <laughs> oh, no, because you're the Messiah. I am. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> I said I want a nice clean Cannonball. Cannonball is such a good track from Zero Three. It's so good. I honestly prefer the the Mythos remix of it compared to the original version. Mm -hmm. I like the I like the Mythos remix of Departure too. The opening song. Departure, yeah. From Zero Two. It's, it's so good. There was one point where I was oh, really fucking okay. good at those games, but I need to play them again and see how much I get my ass kicked. Watch the low blows. I will be there. If you stream it, I will be there, and I will laugh, and I will cry, and then I will rant about CL. She's actually a pretty good character. <laughs> Hope you the... killed Zero again! <laughs> damn it. Damn it! Damn it, Capcom, you killed him again! <laughs> It's okay, he has oh, great immunity. Every time he dies, he'll come back. Stronger even. Yeah. Stronger even. And more handsome. You know, I've, oh, you know I never said this about Maz, but her fangirlism for Zero is so strong, she can keep the Mega Man franchise alive for about 10 years. Yeah. Just with Zero. Yeah. <laughs> uh, whoever like, for warning, this... Warning! Yeah. Warning! Attraction damage! Attraction of rep wards! At a, more than 100%! Warning! 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 Wow, that this... fucking toy right there looks retarded. Yeah. Like, whoever for this mission just... 
Whoever thought Die. of this mission can suck a huge dick. Like, look at how... that fucking last one. <laughs> yeah, look how, like, I just... can narrow that barrel is, and you have to, like, balance I on that I disconnected. I disconnected. I disconnected, then I came back, and all I heard was suck a huge dick. What did I miss in the span of five seconds? <laughs> this mission sucks. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay. That's... Whenever, okay, here's code. Here's... here. This is me. Whenever I say something should suck a dick, that's me saying this is fucking terrible. Yeah. Ah, uh, ah, uh, of course, yes, yes. Well, I got that, but <laughs> so I can't like, get the Wait, how would, it's like, why, would, why would they need to suck your dick? Because it's fucking awful. That's why. I, want a nice, clean fight. <laughs> I mean, look at like, that. That that thing requires so much goddamn precision. It's like, have you ever sucked a dick before? No, but this mission can. <laughs> 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 yeah. God damn it, that was good. I thought that was good. Have you ever sucked a dick before? No, we're gonna start now. Suck this mission's dick. Why? Because it's horrible. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm gonna make a comment about what Hopkins said. It's like, it's like, God, Maddie's love for Zero could make the Mega Man franchise yeah, live did. forever. <laughs> I'm gonna make a comic about it. And you're just like cuddling a zero cutout standing, and I'm just kind of like, you see this woman? This is what true love is like. <laughs> you, see, you see this? This is what true love is. Ah, no, dang it! <laughs> <laughs> just, just a reaction, Harry. No, that wasn't me reacting to anything. It was just like, uh, no, you, you'll see in a second. Yeah, I saw it. You just you just hear in the background. I want to know what love is. In the background. <laughs> it's like it's like okay, first comic. Like Maddie's like fucking like uh, what did I call it? Like fan love or some shit. The next one, out of context, could suck a huge dick. And I'm like, oh, not you, <laughs> Maddie. No, stop. No. Don't get any ideas, okay? It's like, what do you mean an idea is presses the button? Like, what do you mean? What do you mean? I don't know what you mean. Yeah. I'm slowly back to the corner. Yeah. I mean, fuck, I understand talking about our sexual history, but I don't know if I'm ready to share that. Yeah. <laughs> it's like, Maddie, no! Just make, just make, like, a, like, a comic of, like, ah. any of the Maddies just, like, in precarious situations where it's like, Maddie, no! No, stop! <laughs> stop that! No, stop! Yeah. Get out of the barrel! <laughs> See, this wouldn't be so bad if, like, when you went on the rail and that automatically just got- Whoa! Mm -hmm. What the heck was that? <laughs> I just kind of spontaneously jumped in the air. Spontaneously combusted. <laughs> glitch. Oh, glitch. It's like, Shadow! Fight. What? The girlfriend's stuck in a barrel again. Why is she in the barrel? I don't know, but she's in there. Yeah, like if, if you like start you know grinding. There are so many fucking jokes I can make with that. <laughs> it's like, it? Maddie's yeah. in a barrel again. Why is she in the barrel? I don't know. Yeah. I, I, I'd share my jokes right now, but I don't know if you want to hear that. Oh, yeah. share them. I'm, I'm all ears. It's all create. It's all creative process. <laughs> Okay, okay, so, for, it's like, first one, why is she in the barrel? Something about a glory hole. Uh, oh. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. Hi. She heard about the glory hole, and she wanted to know what it was. I think she's disappointed. No. Uh. You just, you just, you just hear disappointed Maddie noises just, uh, just move inside of the barrel. It's just like, ooh, do you need some help getting out? Yes, I'm kind of stuck. I got in, but I can't get back out. Right. Well, That's just the life of a, just the, what, the barrel life. Why is that gate, like, so glitched up? Like, I touch it and I just go flying for no reason. <laughs> yeah, yes. Maddie does have the mentality somewhat of, if I, if it, if I fits, I sits. Yeah. <laughs> what? No. <laughs> You know how cats can fit in boxes? No, 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 no. Sometimes. You, you want to rephrase that. If I fit, I sit. <laughs> yeah, that's what I mean. I'm not rephrasing it, fuck you. Yeah. 
Oh okay, my. Well. I heard for oh, you this one. Oh my. Sad. I fix I sit. Can I? No. Aww. Oh, hopefully, oh. This, hopefully this mission doesn't suck. <laughs> Disappointed, Maddie noises. And I have it's no like, idea what it's like. It's like, oh, can I sit on you? You're short enough to be like that. No. <laughs> I mean, not when there's oh. people around. <laughs> yeah. It's like, aww. <laughs> He's like, just why don't you just go sit on your boyfriend? He forbade me from sitting on him. Why? Do you, know how spiky hedgehog... <laughs> so do you know how spiky Tank hedgehogs are? Hair in AOE. Uh, uh, restraining uh, 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 order. No, you make up a story about how spiky it is, but in reality, it's a restraining order you got. <laughs> yeah. Uh, that's really interesting. <laughs> yeah, I can't believe you fucking missed that target point blank. Again, yeah, I, I swear I clearly hit it as well. What like one thing I realized I'm gonna need like I'm gonna I'm gonna need like com I'm gonna need like a c composite cable adapter so that way I can connect my Elgato so I can like, I can use record GameCube games on my Elgato. Yeah. Like be be because this means I can record Sonic Riders for the for the like the umpteen time again. Yeah. And uh, I can also do Pac-Man World too. Yeah. Because is not a combo. Yes, that is the Shadow and Silver fight in a nutshell. Chaos Control kicks him in the back of the head. <laughs> and I got like, and I guess I, I could also stream a few of the game two games that I have. Because mm. I mean, like, because I have um, I, because I also have because out of the game two games that I got at Adam and Morris, I also got Crash Nitro. And in addition to getting uh, Pac-Man or Jolly, I also got Crash Nitro cards. Nice. Isn't that like Mario Kart Eight before Mario Kart Eight? That's Metro Kart? Mm-hmm. I think so. Clutch! I mean, to, 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 to be perfectly frank, I've been playing more of Pac-Man or Rally than I've been Crash Metro Kart. Probably because of my... Probably due to my... Probably due to, like... Due to the fact that I had, like, an extreme Pac-Man bias as a kid. Mm. And it's... I've had an extreme Pac-Man bias as a kid, and I think, like, it still stands. It now moves to my laptop, so yeah. I probably won't disconnect as much. So yay. <laughs> okay, good. I think I have some ideas. Yeah, I'll, I'll, I will be completely honest with this game, though. They, they, it does go on for a bit, like, the single player does go on for a bit too long. They probably could have cut it down to, like, a hundred missions. Whoa! Hey man, back in the day, this is when you got games that had like that were worth their money. Yeah, but I mean like, uh, well, I I mean it's more the fact that if you want to like have all this content, like all these characters and stages and stuff for the multiplayer, you're gonna have to sink in like a lot of hours to get this stuff. Oh. Oh boy, this one is going really well. You know what? I have Pac-Man World 2, but every time I tell myself I should play it, I get distracted. I need to play the Pac-Man World games. I've only played first two, games. Like, okay. Yeah. I haven't played Pac-Man World 1. I've played 2 and 3. Whoa! whoa. Well, the, the boss fights in World 1 are awful, but the game is fun enough. Well, yeah, Pac-Man World 1 looks decent. Pac-Man World 2 looks really fun. I have and then Pac-Man World 3 looks like garbage. I, yeah, I, I never hear anyone talk about Pac-Man World 3 at all. Yeah, Pac-Man Pac Pac World 3 was... It looked fucking horrible. At least the, the environments did. I have not seen... so bland. I have not yeah, seen Pac-Man World 3 at all, so... Honestly, I, I don't... I, I think you're better off just playing the first two. Just skip three. Well, I'm kind of curious about it, because I've never really seen it before. It's boring visually. Yeah. Mm. Everything's all glo everything's mostly gloomy. Mm. Oh god. <clears throat> Total congestion. My old friend, I hate you. I get congestion <clears throat> all the fucking time. I know how you feel. <laughs> like it's the worst Cr feeling ever because you can't sleep. Yeah. It's just like God. Krogan body slam! Wait, what? 
I'm sorry, I'm playing 14 and this tank is horrible. No, it seriously sounded like you said, man, I can't wait to see how Kratos is as a boss. <laughs> boss. Boss, he gets it. Oh, it's it's like, a hey, well, I remember. I remember against the boss. His, uh, it's like, his, he just yells, boy, at you. Boy. <laughs> and it does rash of damage. <laughs> no, it just <laughs> okay OKOs you. Yep. My boy. <laughs> Yeah. I have work my tomorrow. Oh. There you go. Now you remember you have shield toss. Woo! And learn. <laughs> Oh yeah, I can do that, Whoa. says Captain America. <laughs> Jason, now you know how it feels to be a healer, and that's all I'm gonna say. What? I can't! <laughs> uh. No, just give me a sec, we're almost done. Be nice about it. Jason fights with his mom. <laughs> 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 I hate On today's episode of Jason fights with his mother! <laughs> I'm sorry, but like it, it happens not, too often. It happens too often, so I say it's not. It's too easy to make fun <laughs> mom, of. Mom, mom, sorry. get the pizza bite. <laughs> mom, get the camera. <laughs> mom, 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 I'm talking to a girl. The internet, you're embarrassing me. Oh, I've had that happen. I've had that happen before. I'm like, Mom, I'm talking to a girl on the internet. Be quiet. <laughs> Jason, you know we love you. Just... We love you. Mom, I you're know. ruining my chance at Virginia. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'll never be so oh. virginity with you here. Oh, if I ever, if I ever said that. Oh, dude, um, I, 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 I would be dead. <laughs> <laughs> oh god! <laughs> Please don't stop my call because I'm set now. Down, like it's just calm down. I don't want it to start up again. Alright, right, I think we should calm down a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> and the moment, the moment I said that, my mom goes, probably not. What? <laughs> what? Are you guys gonna mock me? Are you guys gonna mock me? <laughs> <laughs> I think your mom is my most favorite people. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> I'm getting shot at! I don't like this. Come on, shields, come back, I don't wanna die. This is Wait, what's that? Ow! Alright! You know what, just, just with that, Xavier, you're getting missiles next time I take the game. Oh shit! No, <laughs> no, no, no! Oh yeah, well, well, you're, well, you're gonna, well, you're gonna get ten fight trackers. The Cuban Missile Crisis 2018. <laughs> That's pretty much it's like when I have missiles in Splatoon. <laughs> oh, Jason, <laughs> it becomes the Cuban Missile. It's goddamn. On today's episode no of Jason one holds a grudge. No one. <laughs> well, this is a bust. Cause like every single time I've ha I I've used my uh one of my weapons in Splatoon 2 that has missiles, I give Xavier and sometimes Harry hell. <laughs> yeah, that's true. Bust a nut. Anyway, <sighs> cause I get him so frequently. Oh, uh, sorry, I'm, I can't do that now. I'll do it later. Yeah. <laughs> and, what? <laughs> and I'll show it to you later, later, okay? Not when the guys are here. <laughs> And that, like, and then I bought this and threw it to a Texas and utterly died. Oh! <laughs> you know, Xavier, if you want to defeat me, you just use a brush, because I can never handle a brush. 
Okay, hey, why are you telling your enemy your weakness? Thanks for the tip. <laughs> Thanks for the tip. <laughs> no, you know what? If I were, if I were to tell enemies why? tips, I'd just, I'd just I, fuck them I over. I tell them the wrong oh, shit. Oh, yeah. yeah. That's what I would. That's what I would. Do. It's like, hey, mm. hey, you wanted to beat me with, you wanted to beat me with my, you wanted to beat me, then use a fucking paintbrush. <laughs> and I just shoot you from a distance. <laughs> Did you really think it would work? You bitch. It actually does work in Splatoon because I just don't know how to handle them. <laughs> the attack is so wild. I don't, I, I, I don't know. I get flustered. Ah, oh, you get flustered, huh? Interesting. Hmm. Going to use that to my advantage. I don't think flustered that... as in confused. Now, flustered can mean two different things. Confused, yeah, or just... <laughs> but it's funny if I think... <laughs> it would make no sense if I fought it that way. Oh no, yeah. I could just use it I could just use it against you in a... Whoa. Yeah, I can use a lot of things against you. <laughs> but I'll still win. This is why I consider you two the fucking odd couple. Yeah. We're coming right. What are you thinking? What are you thinking? I was the humming the thing from the odd couple. Yeah. Where have you been living? A rock? Do you live in a cave? <laughs> yeah, actually, it's called the bad cave. Wait, wait. When you said, "Do you live in a cave?" That voice. When when you said "live in a cave," I immediately thought of her tofu boyfriend. <laughs> Backward. <laughs> Why does the main protagonist and her tofu boyfriend live in a fucking cave? So I don't even know what the heck you guys are on about. <laughs> I think Harry got lost in the plot. <laughs> Harry's that John Travolta gift where he's just looking around and shrugs his arms. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just listening to you guys talk at this point. This, see, this is this is what Jason likes. Let's think of the topics we went over tonight. Let's see, okay, first up there was busting nuts. Yeah. <laughs> and then there was, <laughs> then there was uh, the master emerald, and then there was oh, yeah. her moms. And then there was Maddie's fan girling over how, zero. And how mothers would de would deny their kids lost to their virginity. <laughs> so I'm just going, oh, I got the pizza, mine's ready. Uh, then we learned of then we learned of Maddie's in in insatiable love for zero. Spiel going strong. And the turtle. Yeah, and the turtle. And, <laughs> and Shadow and 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 Knuckles and there's so many others. <laughs> Personally, yeah. I like the busting the nut the most because it was the most <laughs> random thing ever. Yeah. <laughs> Bust the nut. I can't do that right now. Okay. You can't. Do, you can't do that. Period. Only oh. we can. Sorry, we didn't start. One of the teammates is just bad. <laughs> we're there. I'm almost done. We just gotta wait for this damn tank. You know what? Every time you say it, I know what you mean, but every time I hear that, I just can't help but think like someone's in an actual tank. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh, here he is. After he ran right back to the elevator. <laughs> wow, think... I'm surprised you could fit a tank in an elevator. <laughs> Have you played Metal Slug? No. <laughs> you should. It's a good game. I've heard. I've heard as much. Yeah. Why is there like a million red boxes now? Okay, so I have I have to ask, what are the different what do the different boxes do? Uh they do oh, hi, sweetie. they ho they no, uh hold like like oh, no! no! You can't Punk Meanwhile, I'm arguing, in Australia. I'm yeah. Arguing with little sister. No! Don't you throw that at me! No! <laughs> From the makers of Jason argues with his mom. We have the sub series. Maddie argues with her baby sister. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You know, this is a very odd spin off of the odd couple. Yeah. But, uh, <laughs> but, um, to answer your question. I'm not, I'm not gonna let that go because you two sound like a fucking couple. We're not dating. <laughs> no, I wouldn't I date you. Yeah, that, I that, date that, Jason. That, that would end horribly, to be honest. I wouldn't date Jason <laughs> if I was paid $50. <laughs> 
Sorry, Chase. No, no, if you were the last man on Earth, they still wouldn't okay, date you. Go. Wow, I'm feeling really small today. Uh, <laughs> My ego is shrunk. But uh, to answer your question, to answer your question, Mary, like the book, the uh, there are like specific items tied to the books. Is so like the pink ones uh, have like the umbrella things, like the top spin things, and they they peep sheep. Uh, the red ones have like the electric thing and the boosters and stuff like that. Okay. I think it might be. I I don't know what determines which item you get. It might be like position based. Don't let it hit you move. Don't let it hit you move. Don't let it hit you move. Girl, don't let it hit you move. I actually have the mark of a damn tank, the main, the damn boss, but still a tank to me what the focus is on. I think no. Aww. I I I I think the tank's just scared of Jason. He's a healer right now. Very afraid of your healers. If it continued on, I should have let him die. You should be afraid of your healers. That is why any, nearly, almost every Maddie that I have created, nearly every Maddie uh, I have created, is sort of a medical transponder in some way. Except for Cat Maddie, she's a bounty hunter, but she has her best friend Ruby for that. I, I, you know what? Ruby's I'm giving the recommend, I'm giving the commendation to the Lancer. I'm not even gonna bother. Yeah. Salt. Welcome to my life as a salty bitter healer, Jason. Enjoy your stay. Oh man. <clears throat> God damn it, he's horrible. Welcome to my fucking life. Flash is not all a, 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 a gladiator has. Hot potato coming through. Warning, warning, warning. Salt level approaching the sea. Warning, yeah. I was gonna, warning. I was gonna say, I was gonna say, here's I was gonna say, Maverick approaching. I. <laughs> Maverick approaching. I, I hate when you. You're, you're the Maverick. <laughs> I hate when you try to f go go the the sh the um, the quick way the quicker way and then and then you just get bonked by everyone and go to the the uh, slow path. I got me some experience. I leveled up. I earned that. <sighs> wow! Wow! Yeah. Yeah, Matt, Maddie, I know what you mean now. When it, when you have that one, when you're the healer and your teammates don't cooperate. Hi. Uh, Just dangle yeah, there for a minute, buddy. I'm 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 watching. I'm playing Mass Effect right now. There's plot. Uh, How do you uh, put up with this, Maddie? Anyways, mom, sausages, right? <laughs> Uh, make them extra crispy, mom. Yeah. <laughs> extra crispy. <laughs> so, so we have we have uh, Starhawk's Maddie, who's a burb. What? She's she's a medical engineer. We have Seven, which is Mega Man Maddie. She's a medical scientist and a maverick woman. And then we have Tony Lalafell Maddie from Final Fantasy XIV, who's a white mage, and she's oh, tired and sad. <laughs> Small you know, I've never played much Final Fantasy, but if I were to pick a class, I'd pick the Blue Mage because she says that's the Mega Man class. Where yeah. there's, there's no, powers. There is blue no Blue Mage, mage no. in 14, yeah, but there's Red Mage, and Red Mage is so good. <clears throat> in 14, Red Mage is, yeah, but like in the other ones, it's kind of like, it can do, it can do both things, uh, but it, it, it doesn't excel at them. Nah. Also, I mean, the red mage things to do is just copy people's shit and just mock them for me being better at them than they are. So the, what is the red blue mage, mage then? If we're the red mage is flat out better than everything because it can do everything. Blue blue mage blue mage is as Hub said it's like Mega Man. It's like Mega Man. Blue well, mage is kind of like Mega Man. What, what does that mean though? I don't know. <laughs> that in the Mega Man memories. still. Mega Man copies and steals people's powers. Oh, blue that, mage does oh, the exact same thing. Oh, okay, okay, okay. My dogs are barking. They're barking. So I, Why I, you bark? So I understand. What I understand is like is like red mage is like a mix of red, white, and black. Yeah, it's an all-around class from what I'm understanding here. Yeah, yeah it's a sword. It's, it's a sword. It, it, it can fight. It can fight physically decently well. It can uh, and it can use black magic and white magic. Yeah. Yeah. But it doesn't. It, but in the mainstream Final Fantasy games, it doesn't excel at them. Right. 
uh, jack of all trades, master of none. Yeah. Yeah. You know what? If I ever play Final Fantasy XIV, I would just get out there, trip, and then I'd yeah. <laughs> be like, White Mage, help me! <laughs> Please! Oh. Oh, oh, okay, so okay, then you want to be a Dragoon. No, 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 like, just imagine you... Good? No. Um, they, they take the floor a lot. Well, that oh. is because Dragoons are tend to be... A, dragoon players tend to be reckless. And they die a lot. And you just don't I, raise I, them after the third time Dragoon. that they've died. I main Dragoon, but I haven't tanked the floor as much as Krom has, but... Uh-oh. <laughs> but, like, I... I like... I know, I like to imagine how playing 14. His character just tripping. Oh. And, and then the credits just play. What, <laughs> 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 like... like <laughs> what, like... You know, what I mean? you, know, you know what you just described, Harry? You just described every relationship I've been in. Oh, in my rip. Oh, rip. rip. Aww. Poor oh, hub. Hugs to the internet. I'm gonna do it. At least, you, at least you've been in relationships. That's more than I can say. No, you know what? It's like, that's my relationship with girls in a nutshell. Can we be a couple? No. Together we. I appreciate the emotional support. <laughs> I mean, okay, it's not that bad, but shit, I'm like the most unlucky person when it comes to relationships because I attract the same yeah, woman and then I attract the crazy women too. So I'm like, fuck. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not crazy. Uh, I, I'd argue that, but at least you're not like, at least you're not scary crazy. At least not right now. <laughs> well, yeah, I don't right. stalk people. I don't make people uncomfortable most of the time, and I wouldn't go running around with a butcher knife and threatening to kill people who didn't love me. So uh... I'm good. Yeah, we don't need. You like... know what? Now that you say that, I'm just gonna leave my windows open all night. Okay, let's roll. <laughs> yeah, we, we we don't need yandere's in real life, thank you. I'm I'm not one of those. Trust me. I'm more of a sundere than a yandere. Okay, that I can yeah, deal with. That I can deal with. <laughs> you are. You act like one. <laughs> Every Maddie is a sundere. Except for Seven. She's more of a, I'm in love with this person who probably doesn't love me back. So mm -hmm. sit, I'm just gonna sit and pine from afar. That's what I'm gonna do. No, you exist. And she's like, that's okay. Like, that's but okay. you're making yourself miserable. It's and not... then like the guy who does know her is like, hey, you wanna get dinner? No, why? Because I need to watch this guy. It's not like I, I like you or anything, Baka. <laughs> Baka. Baka. Hey. This is not wrong. They just won't fit. The sausages just don't fit. I will say, like, another oh. reason why I think that they could have cut down the missions right. in this game is because there aren't really that many tracks in this game to begin with, so you kind of just see the same ones over and over and over and over again. Is it kind of redundant? Yeah. Or repent. No, repent. I think it's a better. It's the appropriate word. Yeah. <laughs> How many? Going back a second. Going back a second. Um, like, uh, what kind of player are you usually in RPGs? Oh, I thought you were gonna say, what kind of player are you in terms of like getting a go? <laughs> <laughs> you know what? I'm. You know what? What kind of player I am? I'm the one right now. Like, I just act all casual, and, and they think I'm really cool. We just look at Nats right now, she likes me. Okay, uh, I think Nats My sister just popped a balloon. <laughs> okay, Nats, okay, Nats, to answer your actual okay, question, I haven't really... Oh, sweetie, it's okay. He just popped the balloon, it's fine. Okay, Jason, to answer your actual question. I haven't played too many RPGs, but my general <laughs> no. is kind of like no. more defensive <laughs> and wait for the opening to attack. That's my general game plan. No, okay. Really? No. What the okay. fuck is going on there? Because <laughs> like, there's not necessarily defensive in 14, like in terms of like character, in terms of like, because because you know it's like real time. It's like one of those um yeah. things where like. You know, uh -oh. 
No, you're not the supposed best, to be in here. The best game I can describe it to is Xenoblade Chronicles, and even then, it's not really the same thing. What game are you talking about? 14, yeah. 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 Like, they're very different. Yeah. Like, like, the, like the, the, the role that everybody plays it has a similar thing to it, but say hi to the guys. how the gameplay itself say works. Hi. It. Hi. 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 Hey, hi. Hi. Okay, now we go go say bye. You say bye bye. Bye bye. <laughs> bye. Oh, right. Wait, me? Yeah. Uh, I don't know. The last are, are you still the sister are you, recovered. Are you, are you still in the McConnus field or? Yeah, I'm pretty sure I haven't played it since. Uh, like I I sent that picture. No. Go. Yeah. <laughs> No! Good lord. Okay, well... It, okay, Jason, how about this? Whenever I play fighting games, I always play towards my favorite characters. So they have a variety of game styles. Some are rushdowns, some are more defensive, keep-away types. Yeah. What type would that be? What would that translate to? Hmm, I'm trying to think, guys. Uh, I'm, looking for all, I'm looking at all the classes right now, just to do an idea. Like, you want something that has more, that can like kind of do it all when it needs to? Yeah. Um, that sounds more like the red mage, I guess. Because you can cure, you can uh, and, and you can uh, and you can fight. You can get close up if you need to, and you can back off and do your spells. Yeah, mm -hmm. that'd be not, that. That sounds good. Problem with Re problem in that regard is Red Mage is a class that was introduced in the Stormblood expansion, and as such, you actually need to hit level 50 in order to even access it. I have returned with lemonade. Because I'm early, yeah. early sugar, on. Sugar, blood oh, sugar oh. is kind of low. Um, if you don't mind, if you, oh, if, I know I guess, what blood sugar is like. I deal with it every day. I guess something that can, uh, Maddie, can you think of like an er of a one of the classes in f in 14 that can. Kind of like do all and do all it needs to um, when it need, when it needs to. I would say summoner, but since the changes have happened, summoner su summoner's opener takes two minutes long, two to three minutes long. That's how long the, the fucking opener is. Doing all that. But... Yeah, and the ro the rotation is ridiculous. Um, um, it does what it needs to. Black mage does what it needs to. Black mage is a burst DPS class. I thought you were gonna say. Uh, to uh, I thought you were say black mage is a bird. Maybe paladin. <laughs> black mage is a bird. Uh, but paladin. I would recommend dark knight, honestly. Even though paladin can can heal itself because clemency is broken, hollowed ground doesn't always actually work, and I'd much rather be a dark knight. Works. <laughs> we got Lenny. Because. <laughs> Because it's a, it's dark. Dark Knight is more of a magic-based class, and the Blackest Knight is the best fucking skill because you put it on your healer, and they don't take as much damage, and you're just like, I'm the best. Because Dark Knights yeah. are also very attractive. Yeah, Dark Knight, and, and the changes that were added to it do make it a lot more convenient battle-wise as well. Yeah, and then there's Warrior, which has no fucking aggro. Take crazy. You say that as I've actually been shown you, I'm a decent warrior. Yeah, but you don't like Cory. You mean- well, at least I don't cleave the group. You have an aggro table. Cory doesn't have one. <laughs> Cory in house. <laughs> so I- I had to. Hey, you wouldn't get- you, you- you guys wouldn't get it, but we wa- um, we watched um, what's the channel's name? Dr and Drac? We- we- we watch this guy called Drakenstein Gaming, and he does raid group. And there's this there's this tank who's his buddy. His name is Cory, and he's a warrior. And throughout their adventures through Heaven's Word and Stormblood, Cory cleaves the group because some yeah, bosses basically, cle basically cleave. Basically, leads himself into when the enemy is about to do like a AOE or something. And then yeah. and then he hits the entire party with it, and then nice. he, he has no aggro table, and he also dies a lot. Nice. He doesn't care. He's very, he's very, he's very casual troll. Yeah. He's, he's, he's having fun. 
It's pretty much like what when, he's doing. when they did Kefka Savage, he's like, because when they had to sign groups, he's like, I want, I want, like, because every, everybody had to get assigned a DPS. He, ah. And then, like, uh, see, guys, like, uh, why don't you pick a DPS? It'd be funnier. I want them to choose who dies with me. <laughs> I want them to know what I'm doing. This is why I have to. <laughs> and that's why they had to give him, like, the mark in the, the markings. You yeah, have the markings so people will know where he is. <laughs> um, Cor yeah, it's like they gave him the thing. It's like, Cor um, Cory, we don't mean we don't want to run to you. I mean, Dracos, it's not for people to run to Cory. It's for people to know where Cory is. But we never need to know where Cory is. I would beg to differ. <laughs> <laughs> you have to, you have to know where he is. It's just okay. most of it is just so funny. Yeah, I think usually when they mark him, that's when he stops trying to cleave everybody because he knows where they're coming. He knows he's coming. Yeah. Yeah. Uh. I mean, when he tries, he's de he's actually pretty good at tanking. So Dark Knight, Batman, all right. Duh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, um, you have to get the heavens where to access it unless you buy this thing that lets you get to level 60 immediately. Yeah. But, I mean, I probably Dark wouldn't even be a Dark Knight anyway. Be oh god, the Dark Knight, the oh, Dark Knight quest line. Like, the Dark Knight so quest line is cool. It's one of the well-written story uh, class quest lines. We're not gonna say game. anything either. You know what? Yeah, I can just there's... imagine myself making a ton, a ton of Batman jokes with that. Uh, oh, pe people have made edge lord jokes about Dark Knights, and as I said, stated before, it makes me kind of feel like Shadow, but with a sword, not Lancelot. Fuck that fight, honestly. Fuck that fight too. Lancelot returns. Fuck that shit. <laughs> Oh my god, I, I needed the, I needed that tutorial video in order to get a good idea how to handle him. I do like the challenge. Yeah, uh, it's, that... it's, yeah, I do like the challenge too, but I'm just saying, like, I would never have gotten five stars if it wasn't for that video that in, in the game. Like, at, like, at least it's, like, um, fairly designed. Yeah, at least- <laughs> Mr. figure. Cause like, at least we give you the video of, of an idea how to do it, and even then you can see the tutorial guy even actually having to actually fight him. My favorite thing is that when you when you go fight the knights, um, <laughs> when you fight the knights, like their themes play in the distance, so so like we, like throw it all away. I'm like, oh yeah, this doesn't actually fit, and then you just look in here, unknown from every bastion in the distance, and you're like, this does not fit. This does not fit at all. What the hell? I'm goals. <laughs> Oh. Thanks, Hub. Thanks, Hub. Uh, <laughs> Thank you, Hub. <laughs> no problem. What did I miss? Um, you missed quite a lot, actually. Um, a lot, you, you a lot of craziness. Is an RPG? Huh? Yeah, so I'll be a red mage, I guess. When you have to be to level it? 50 to- You have to be at least level 50 to unlock red mage because it's a late game class. Although yeah. you can add these at any point, you don't have to get the heavens word. Yeah, that's you totally have that's to totally... have you have to you have to have the Stormblood expansion to even have the class. Or anything. Yeah, they're talking oh. about fourteen right now. I was gonna say, so I was about to see the RPG. You know, but Lewis, you, yeah. Lewis, you did miss something extraordinary, like me doing my normal fangirling over zero and. Matt, Maddie's love for this character can keep the Mega Man series alive. And then you missed another argument with me and my mom. Yay. Yeah, yeah we were making fun. Mom, I'm trying to listen. Uh, mom, no. I'm trying to talk to some friends. Yeah. And like, how about, how about one point? How about one point was to say, Mom, you're lo <laughs> ruining my chance at losing my virginity. Losing my virginity. <laughs> <laughs> That wasn't me, but, for the record. No, 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 like, I won't, I won't even have to wait long for a moment to have a career. Hey. And, and, like, and Hub's like, you, and Hub's like, Maddie, you and Jason are like the odd couple. <laughs> hey. Oh, God. I, I'm, I'm just gonna put my Magitek gear on and, and just be but like, like, uh... Under <laughs> uh <laughs> imagine, like, a, a C's brain RPG, that would be funny. <laughs> They'd probably just be- yeah. and Jason would probably hate me, because I'd be like, So, how was Mads? Shut up, hub. <laughs> <laughs> I'm that bitter, what, angry what? healer that doesn't I talk to anybody. RPG, you mean Metopia? Yeah. Oh. You mean Metopia? <laughs> we- You really need to get a 3DS recorder yeah. just so you can do that. Oh yeah, definitely. They... And you, you, you promised to do the editing I told you to do, right? It just- Yeah. Uh, it's just the fact that like 3DS capture cards are like stupid expensive. Yeah. 
The thing you have to do with trigger catch cards is that it's either you have to send your 3DS to the person who's doing the catch card, or you have to buy another one already it's been made with. I'm probably just gonna buy a used one off eBay. <laughs> but, yeah. Buy what? Buy. <laughs> so, like, yeah. you're being on the back of it, right? Yeah, I think that's just a. There's a an extra USB slot for the recording wires or whatever. What's that music sound? I don't know. In the night, strange as I. Yeah, I'm sorry too. Man, you know what? I fucking love these streams. We can go from the master animal discussions to Mom, I'm trying to lose my goddamn virginity. I can't. I I I, I kind of I kind of need that to be honest, because the game itself, I'm kind of getting fatigued. Good night, John boy. Good night, John boy. Opens the door. John boy. Damn it! Can a man masturbate in this house? Cause I, I, I I'm kind of, I'm, I'm kind of, I'm kind of getting tired of this game. <laughs> I, I understand, Harry. When you're playing a game by yourself, it gets tedious. But then, like, if you, if you're hearing like voices of people that have the same interests as you talking about it and doing fun stuff, it actually makes the game more tolerable. Yeah. Cause this is a I fun game, but like, you know, it's just I can just, imagine the so Mega Man X6 stream I'm gonna do is gonna be the fucking best stream ever. Because it's just- Yeah, I'm gonna be there. I'm gonna cry. Like, and oh, stop dying! Oh, I'm sorry! Oh, I- I haven't- Don't finished. play with X! Play with Zero! <laughs> I haven't really decided what to stream <laughs> after this No, guy. I need to prove myself that I'm an alpha male. I his X. <laughs> Fine then, you just suffer, and I'll laugh. You know what? I'm gonna do a- I'm gonna do a, a dungeon blind as the healer. So, uh, wait, Who's it, texting me? So I forget, are the Bayonetta games available in the Switch yet? So what? Bayonetta. Yeah, they are. I think so. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. They are. Yeah, yeah Bayonetta, the, it, it's been on the Switch since February. I think Bayonetta, right. and I, I think one's cheaper. Do they, can you get like both yeah. games in like a bundle? I think um, so. Kind of. Yeah. You can buy the second game, and it comes with a download code. What city thing. of Am of Ampador? Did I pronounce that right? Huh? Am Ampador. Ampador. Am 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 What the fuck ever? Speak speaking of getting another game with a game, um, I love the fact that when I got Mario Kart 8 Vanilla for the Wii U, uh, they also gave us Metroid Other M. I have no idea why. <laughs> So what? I just kind of have other M. <laughs> oh, what? I just kind of got other M in Mario Kart 8 for no reason. It's amazing. They just gave you it? I don't even know. It's like some bonus thing. <laughs> um, yeah, I don't know. And for that reason, and that reason alone, that's why other M is the only Metroid game I own. <laughs> Not counting a, a <laughs> not not counting AM to a, because I that's something else. You need to get even zero mission. Oh. Yeah. Zero mission is fantastic. Yeah. It's my favorite Metroid game. My like my my I I need to finish over M. I, I think I'm like near the end. I don't. Mm. But like. Have you fought Ridley? I don't think so. Drac, your model! Drac, your model! But like... No, my, my, my goal is to finish over him and then go back to the other games. Because... You, you want your opinion of ever to be better? <laughs> yeah, because I feel like if I played the other games first, I, I would not really like over him that much. Because that's like... Because that's like, like, like... That's like a casual player. I'm enjoying other run for what it is. Fair enough. I like how this game like t um what was it uh sees anything below first as a failure. <laughs> <laughs> if you ain't first, you're last. <sighs> yeah. I always race to win. Keep my attitude. Yeah. I do. I do have the Metro Prime trilogy on my wa watch list. Yeah, like like, and Nicole, remember, I love you. Yeah. Actually, I was gonna say second place is but that one's good. Oh, 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 yeah, Gumball. Do you, yeah. do you think they should re uh, re release the Metro Prime trilogy on the Switch? Oh, yeah. Oh. No, oh, wait, 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 w
Yeah. Alright. Um, they could. Because I, you know... You're right there, Lewis! I, I think they, they're really still they having a lot of Metro Prime 4. It might be a good way to, like, build up hype. Mold yeah. Colony. Yeah, they, they could release the Metro Prime trilogy. So that way you could have play all four games on the Switch. Yeah. We all danced in fire. Fire! Trapped in this machine. We oh all don't yeah. know. Fire! I, no, I, I love this. I love... <laughs> I love the this the, this um, edit oh. of the uh, uh, last Airbender yeah. intro. It was, it was just like everything changed when the Fire Nation attacked. Fire! Fire! Burn to the ground! Burn to the ground! Burn to the ground! Everyone changed when the Fire Nation attacked. Yeah. Fire! 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 Pinky fire! Pinky fire! Pinky fire! 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 Hands off my bread! I will burn my bread! Don't burn your bread. That that just that's just terrible toast. Personally, oh, I shit. prefer the yeah, uses a lot. I accidentally burns. burns toast makes me sad. Burn what? Oh my god! Get over your fucking icon. Every time I look at it, <laughs> yes, yes. it's like stop. <laughs> it. Get your get your surprise. What's what's so funny? Your icon. Dude, your icon. I just look at it. It's just yeah, like, whatever. It's not, it's just, that's like whenever I like see like talk to That's me it. whenever I that's me whenever I see a girl I like. <laughs> that's like <laughs> like whenever I'm talking to it in the text chat, it's just like uh, uh. Don't take it serious because it's just fucking Sonic no. face. <laughs> I need to look this for uh funny. I need to look for what I told Lewis yesterday or the other day, I forget when. I I I, I said um hold on. Mimic! Where is it? Uh, Kill it! Oh, here it is. I just whatever I want, homie. I just things I uh, on things I like too. I don't discriminate, my nigga. Oh. <laughs> oh. And, and that's with the fucking icon. Here, let me see. Oh wait, that that could have been dangerous. <laughs> oh, that that. <coughs> be be oh. careful when you say stuff like that. Sorry. Yeah. Sorry. Me, we, we can swear, but we don't say racial slurs. Um, Maddie, what are those really big, um, plant creatures called again? <laughs> like it looks like a child like over there! Looks like my, one of my terrible drawings. One Comes to Lewis in the distance, he'd be like, Your drawings aren't trash, Maddie, why? Wait, what? Hmm. Wait, where'd where the red mage go? <laughs> he, he blew up. Here. Yo, that is oh kind of creepy. God. Look how Babyface is please. just in, in the background there. Please, That's actually please, kind of please disturbing. don't, says Scrappy. Please don't, says Scrappy. Oh, oh wait, I got marked. What does that mean? What does that mean? Oh god, oh god. Are you serious? Oh, it's wrong, Harry. Look at oh. how, how long that race tournament is. What the hell? That's ridiculous. Oh that was creepy. One thing that I like, one of my big, one of my, one complaint that I kind of have about Pac-Man World Rally is, is um, like, is a there, there are, there are additional items that you have. To, like there are additional unlockable items, but the thing that 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 you that you have to unlock after eating a certain number of ghosts, because that's because I mean like that's a, that's one mechanic that Pac-Man World Rally has is that like on each track on, on each track there are switches that activate pack dots and others that activate fruit. Exactly if you collect the fruit, you can use it to go oh. through shortcuts that will get with the matching fruit on it. Oh, I was gonna getting say. Yeah, get, 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 and getting enough pack dots turns you turns your car into a pack mobile, <laughs> so you can eat the other racers. Thing is, you have to eat a certain number n amount of racers in a specific cup to unlock. 
to to unlock to unlock items. And the first few, it's on on and like but like unlike the first cup, like unlike the first like the cherry cup, you you have to eat four ghosts, which is fine enough. Unlike um the unlike unlike on another cup, you have to eat like eight ghosts, which is still doable. Yeah. On the on the third on the third one, you have to eat ten to unlock one, and then on the last other one, you have to eat twelve. But on the but like but on the one where you have to eat twelve, there's only three tracks instead of four. Have the garbage. Also, um, Xavier, the first time you said fruit, um, I see, I see before like. <laughs> You're like you press the switch or whatever you whatever you said. Um, you you unlock poop. Oh. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Every time someone comments on my icon, I'm not Sonic. Yeah. But yeah, like yeah, but yeah, like yeah. I'm like um, on the the classic cup only has three tracks instead of four for some reason. And what's interesting in the PSP version of the game, there actually is an original track it's called Subterranean Speedway, and it's based off of Dig Dug. And like, yeah, like it's, I think it's weird that the PSP version is the, is actually the definitive version of Pac-Man World Rally because not only does it have an additional track, it also has more guest characters. Yeah. What does it have? Um. Well, I mean, like, well, in, in, in terms in terms of the character roster, you have Pac-Man, Miss Pac-Man. Pac-Man Jr. The, and the Ghost, and and then you also have like the you, know, you also have the main antagonist from the Pac-Man World trilogy. You have Talkman from Pac-Man World One, Luigi from Pac-Man World Two, Ir and Irwin from Pac-Man World Three. A new character named Pac Devil made for the game. And in terms of the guest characters, you have um, the Puka and Figar, like the, the the balloon and dragon enemies from Dig Dug, um, the the prince from Katamari, and the and in, and like and the PSP version also adds in Mr. Driller and Mappy as guest characters. Mm. Nah, okay. Wait, cool. what's the thun drop dance? Oh. Oh. Sorry. My favorite, my favorite moment in Sonic Unleashed is when Amy does her thing and she actually doesn't realize that it actually is Sonic, and I'm just like, oh, poor guy. Feels bad, man. Yeah. And one thing that's me. Is that, like, in, in the one thing I thought is that in the game's opening intro movie, you see Subterranean Speedway in it, which implies that it was probably going to be in the console version, but it wasn't. Uh, wait, what's this? Oh, Pac-Man or Rally. Oh. This is when every platformer series had a goddamn race. Oh, that's like uh, it's like how um, uh, Rayman M or Rayman Arena has like Lee the fairy on the on the back of the box, yet she's not in the game itself, and it's really stupid. False advertising. Yeah. I guess I guess um, what's what's the what's the um, fairy they use again? I don't know, but you. Wait, it's like she's similar in appearance, but that it's not the same thing though. <laughs> That's, that's just Together like Together we can show the world what we can do! What's with these race tournaments that have like 50 levels? Harry, I think, you're, <laughs> I think your enthusiasm for this game has just been fucking destroyed at this point. Yeah. Sounds like you're tired. I mean, but I believe in you, Harry. I mean, the, I mean think about it oh, this way. way. Think about it this way, the only reason why the stream is as good as it is is because we talked about busting nuts and shit. <laughs> yeah. Busting okay, okay. nuts! I'm gonna yeah. do two, do these two baby face challenges because they, they seem to be short. But, um... I was, yeah. gonna, I, I was actually gonna do the baby face challenge as well, but I don't know if it's a bit too late for me or not. Huh? Wait, you want you if you you want to wait you want to stream something? I'm gonna stream something, yeah. Was it was it gonna be Necro Dance or something else? Uh, I don't know yet. Well, I'm, I'm, not, I'm, well, I'm not sticking around till four or five a.m. <laughs> I'll stick around. If, I, I'll stick around if Willis wants me to. I got I gotta do something with some buddies, so I, I don't think I can show up to that. Uh, it like, is you really right late, now, so you don't... know. You have more buddies, Hub. Congratulations. Yeah, I do. That. Oh, me. Yeah. But I, I, yeah. I, I'll, I'll probably, I'll probably just finish the game tomorrow. I'm just gonna do these two challenges. Are you streaming? Are you streaming tomorrow, Harry? I'll try to. 
Okay, if you if you do, I'll show. I'll just <laughs> talk about busted nuts some more. Yeah, because uh, we're so close to the end of this game at this point. I don't want to. I don't want to abandon it now. I mean, fuck. Dude, how long is this game? Yeah, seriously, like, uh, I think I'm like ten hours <laughs> in. Jesus Christ! It feels like fucking more than that. Like it, the, the, like this shouldn't feel like the length of a uh, a, a, a full... Lego game. Yeah, or like a just a regular game. Hey. Even my own like the London Olympics or any of the Olympic games, though. Especially when story modes are. Con mm, you just got it. Now my favorite thing to do is rhythmic ribbon, just so I could see the ridiculous characters try and be oh, fucking yeah. graceful. Leg. Yeah. Or, or that. Or that whole. Uh, oh, balance. Take this. Oh. Or that whole uh, oh. play Take playlist this. that Jason sent me of. Rio, Rio Olympics, freaking rhythmic gymnastics. Speaking, uh, speaking of balance, the only the, the other complaint I have is when we got items get unbalanced because more than yeah. because like yeah. most of the because yeah time yeah, but I feel like it's a bit more ridiculous because more than one person could get that game's version of the blue shell. Yeah. Wow. I mean, luck, luck, luckily it doesn't it doesn't slow you down too much, but the fact that Multiple. Yeah. The fact that more than one person can get a can, can get the blue shell, even in, even in second place you can get it. <laughs> and what that, what's weird is that you can also get it in first. <laughs> what's weird is you can even get it in first place. You can even get it in first place. Although I don't know why you'd want to use it on yourself, but you can get That's it. That's hilarious. Together <laughs> we can show the world what we do. Blow yourself up. <laughs> Can I ask you that? Can I ask you that? I'm crying because I fucking hate the blue shell. What is that? <laughs> yeah. yeah, it's the blue shell right on yourself! Blow yourself up! Congratulations, you just played yourself. Yeah. Oh god. <laughs> Congratulations, yeah. douchebag, you just played yourself. Yeah. yeah. Congratulations, you played yourself. Maria? That's me every day. Yeah. Maria. Maria? Oh, this sucks. Come on, expected Helios. I saw I saw this one post on Tumblr. It did have to do with Shadow. It was like reciting his lines like "I'm a weapon" and stuff like that. And at the end of it, it was paint just drawing a Maria, just shouting "No!" <laughs> and I'm like, "Why would you do this? Can yeah. you not stop it? Yeah, stop hurting you, please." Show. Leave Ooh, Shadow alone. He's not angsty anymore. He's just a badass. Oh, hi. Hi. Makes flowering. Uh, yeah, sure. I, I, I didn't care about this game anymore. <laughs> oh boy, what's he gonna put in? Oh shit. <laughs> Puddle getting oh man, I know, I know a silver gun Jason, but jeez. Only one silver gun, so you know. Right. Not, not spamming a playlist. Yeah, either. don't do, yeah, don't do a playlist. Oh god. Of course it's this one. Wait, wait, wait. Why I am don't... I not? Why am I not oh. surprised? <laughs> there it is. Nice. <laughs> nice. <laughs> why there it is. Egg. Don't die, red man. Okay. I, I, I had to pause it so it could actually be picked up. Cause it was that looks really quiet for me. <laughs> Together we. <laughs> God. Yeah, I'm so I'm sorry, everyone, but like. I don't even know why that fucking that's so funny. Like, is she is she? Just can't tell from my voice. I'm just mentally drained from this game. Hey, I can tell. Uh, Did you need me to do an energy transfer? I can try and transfer peppy my peppy energy into you across the internet. <laughs> that would help. <laughs> Take my energy. Take my energy. <laughs> if, if I had like a if I, if I had like a lemonade drink or something, that would help. But no. 
Raise your head and give raise your arms up this guy and give me your energy. Drink some coffee. Harry. I don't even think I have Harry. lemonade in the house right now. Spare bomb! Oh, Harry, did you hear that that that, that there are additional that there's gonna be additional hairstyles for the upgrading? Uh no, I haven't. That sounds interesting. Oh, uh yeah, yeah. I've been waiting for the spirit bomb to be a fucking super move in Dragon Ball Fire. I'm surprised they haven't done it yet. <laughs> oh, oh, my God. Is it one of them an afro? Yeah, yeah, yeah. One for the Inkling boy is a... And the one... And the other one boy. Yeah, like, yeah, sorry. Yeah, one for the Octo boy is a is an afro. And the one for the Octo girl is, like, a top-knot bun, similar to one of the ones for the Inkling girl. I might use that, actually. It's not the default. Oh, oh. the top-knot bun? Yeah. I'm probably gonna use the afro. <laughs> you yeah, I would. I found the coming I, I, the, uh, I can do <laughs> because that because now oh and if I start using the afro brush, I can be Bob Ross. <laughs> <laughs> like, yes. Yeah, like yeah, with an afro brush or ink brush, I could be Bob Fine. Ross. Guys. Yes. Oh, I found something Um. <laughs> Anyway, I'm just, you know, not just red double roast, but so we're going to do that. fight! Bar fight! Bar fight! Bar fight! What am I doing? Uh, nothing, you just insulted me. Oh, I'm sorry. Yeah. <laughs> Wait, don't make that noise! I'm gonna fix it. I'm gonna fix it. Oh, yeah. The, um... Oh, no! Me! <laughs> So yeah, I just found, just found a comment on that the movie video and and uh, it says when you get a girlfriend but you already understand that. Oh. Mm. Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Wait, what was it? What was the second part? When you get a girlfriend but you end with her in the same day. Mm. <laughs> fuck, I at least last fuck, I at least last more than that. <laughs> <laughs> that is actually fucking crap. Yeah. Ay, ay, ay. I mean, fuck, I, fuck, at least relationships I have last. They lasted what? They at least last longer than a week. Yeah. Yeah. My, my only fucking relationship I've been in the last since much a week. Why? How bad was yours? Uh. I asked her, and a week later she went to uh, went with somebody else. God damn. Yeah, that was, yeah. That's pretty much that my, shit. That's my fucking real boss in general, mate. Fuck that. I mean, that, that's always the fucking worst in the world. Mm. Is when, like, you think you meet someone and then they go with some. Like, fuck, man. Is, is that, you know what's even worse about that? It wasn't even just somebody else, it was one of our best mates at college. Mm. You, know, you, know, you know what? I have. I, yeah, I ah. don't. I've actually experienced that, where I had a friend. Who did that? And I'm just like, oh, I don't think I can trust you anymore. Fuck, man, I know how you feel. It makes you feel like shit. I know. But, thing is, yeah. thing, I can't really complain so much because about two weeks later, she went with somebody else and dumped their, 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 their friend of mine. Oh. Yeah. oh my goodness, Mr. 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 sucks. Conky dongs. I don't know how many. <laughs> <laughs> ah, this mission sucks conky doms. Fabulous. Conky doms. <laughs> ah, conky doms. <laughs> what does a conky dong even look like? It, huh? Hair is, it like mm. is, it, is it like a dildo? Yeah. Is that what it is? Hair <laughs> <laughs> is. Why are you got something else? Hey, tell me what a conky dong is, please. <laughs> no. Why not? <laughs> because if he tells us he's really scared that he's really scared that one of us is will go insane over it. I'll stop. I'll stop Please, you, I... <laughs> he's the Conky Dong master. <laughs> I can't ask DK. He's not here. I don't even know. I don't even want to know what kind of fun you know with him. Uh... <laughs> yeah, boy. I want to kill myself. <laughs> and so does Conky Dog. <laughs> <laughs> like, I want to die. <laughs> Pretty much. <laughs> <laughs> want to die. That's me right now. Hey, that's good. That's good. 
Like I knew, I knew this game was wrong, but why? Yeah, baller. <laughs> this game can suck a donkey dong. Oh. This game can suck my dick. What, why is Pokey <laughs> playing one. 50 right, million? Yeah. Uh. <laughs> There's something. <laughs> <laughs> I, I like how the AI just suck, just so I can't kill them, so then I can't, no, no. so then oh, I can't oh, finish the Harry. challenge. Poor Harry, pat pat. Like, who does, who designed this? No, 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 you censor all the swears with on it going, God! <laughs> just makes it funny. <laughs> Said all the swears with random voice clips. <laughs> Feeling really good, Dong. <laughs> like, it's come to a point that I'm just so exhausted that I'm just like... The littlest things are just annoying me in this game now. Harry's like, let me die, and Davis like, no Harry, I'm not finished with you. Nice and slow. Yeah, boy. <laughs> Die, Woody. I mean, it should be more than enough for me. Hey, speak for yourself. Me is a side nightmare. Why are you going over there? Staring at it from afar. Have I seen it before? Yes, Harry, it's called Harry everyday life. Insane. It must be the conky don getting to him. <laughs> <laughs> oh God, no! <laughs> And of course, Buzz is like 50 miles away, so I can't kill him. Wait, the Kong oh, Dong is, is miles away. <laughs> my laugh is so ugly, guys. I'm so sorry. No, it's like, why? Well, why? Why does? What? What of the AI like never fail to like be a million miles away from us? So like, I just can't kill them, and then I just can't beat the challenge because I need to kill everyone. <laughs> How is like just let me kill him? Just let me kill him. <laughs> Harry wants the choker, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> Oh no, my picky snort! No, my picky snort came out! No! No! Oh my god, the picky snort. No! It's ugly! It's not ugly! It's not fucking that! I mean, personally, snorts can make a lot cuter. But I'm not cute! I knew a girl who I knew a girl who would snort when she have like crazy, and I always made fun fun of her with that. <laughs> oh, MLG. <laughs> Louis be like, Maddie, shut the fuck up, you're cute, Maddie. No, I'm not, bitch. <laughs> you can't do it. <laughs> and then when I say you're cute, you're like, thank you, <laughs> thank you, bitch. <laughs> You thank me before calling me a bitch. Okay, Ham, don't, don't, don't. Thank you, good friend. You know, for some reason, she's like more polite with me. Oh. I don't know why. I don't know why she's I don't more polite. With me. Should I be scared? Um, <laughs> no, I'm probably going to be scared. No, it's because I'm like the shortest first room. I, I actually made like this, this, like this running gag. There's like a running. I'll tell you. Ah! What? I'll tell you. Five seven. You're probably taller than me. You're probably, you're definitely taller than me. I'm like, I'm, I'm like the top Yeah, I'm short as fuck. So you're tall. You're probably taller than me by like inches. Sam. I, I'm oh, not exactly sure. <laughs> it's been a while since I measured myself. No, it's just more like whenever I make fan characters, shortest guy, just because there's been a running gag between all my friends. Small. Yeah. Small, small boy. Yeah, small. small. Boy. <laughs> if I ever make fan characters, I would have down with a baby face. No, I'm actually, I actually have like a really manly face. I just, I'm just short and I mm. suck. You're probably always coming to the side to the side of your face. Yeah, that's it. Well, the thing is, that's the same with me, because my voice is like deep as fuck sometimes. Like, and, then, and then you see my face, and it's like, what the fuck? 
Yeah. yeah. If, I, if you guys, if you guys know, like, you'd be like, why does this man sound like he's fucking 14? Why do you marking me? Why do you like, you know, you know, I first got the deep voice, like, when I was like 14. I, I also got this voice when I was like 14. Mm. No, you know oh. what? I've always made a joke about this. I think I traded off having a manly voice in favor of like hair. Like, I can grow a beard in a week and it hurts like hell. And like, I, I hear guys who can't grow beards who are like, man, I wish I could grow beards so I can be manly. I'm like, man, you have no idea how lucky you are. Yeah. I sound like I'm 14, but I can. Yeah, that's yeah. pretty much me in a nutshell. I saw I saw the part very first time when we saw it in my captain club and just to see it to people. I I'm always polite to people I, unless they're I'm a bitch. I know I've never said anything about being polite. <coughs> no, it's just oh boy. How when it comes voice just nearly go die. I think Harry is dying from the conky. <laughs> Harry, no. I, uh, no! No! Harry! <laughs> it's like we need to put like a fucking we need to put that clip of Tom McGuire yelling Harry from Spider-Man 3. <laughs> Yo, what I love I love the yeah. fact that like some of these target minigames have li literally placed the targets in the same exact places as like other ones. It's like what is even the point of this? Die. I'm just at that <laughs> point where I'm running and and uh, hate everything. I hate everything. I hate all of you. Yeah. I am the angriest I man on the planet. I am the Let darkest of days. I love money. I hate all of you. Where's the I last really wish I, I bet you're all wearing your. I bet Harry is wearing his. I really wish I weren't here. Uh, CLUTCH! I hear with Clutch. I'm, I'm just looking at the stream waiting to see some. Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh And that's- and that's one free masturbation on stream right there. <laughs> 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 Good lord. I didn't think she would be this easy to make life. Price. I have no fucking idea. I'm okay. I'm okay. I got it. I'm under. under. Uh, Everything is under control. Baby. I'll hold that girl in front of my door. Over so 10 hours. Why? Holy shit. That was a clutchy shit. Oh my oh. god. Ten hours of this crap. Jesus Christ. This 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 was rash where Yeah. I was stuck on this for four hours. <laughs> and that's why I'm good at sucking dick. Cause I was stressed the game itself is good, but like they really didn't need to make the single player this long. Me when I, me when I think about Batman Arkham, Arkham Knight. Also, I'm pretty sure my voice doesn't go that high. I mean, if you've been listening to mine, you'd be like, "Damn, do you have your balls ever dropped?" Yes, but you can't hear it. Oh, you're probably the exact opposite of me then. You've got a manly face, but uh, but not uh, but the kids can not be your voice and like say a better say my face and voice. <laughs> I mean, I do, I do get a lot from my mother. It's just, you know, I, I look like a face because I'm, it isn't one of them. No, my face looks more like my dad's. It's just, it's just I have the fucking voice of like a nasally man. <laughs> okay, Reyes, where the hell are you? Jesus. Where are the cocky dogs are? Uh, do you guys have any closing words? Uh, <laughs> cocky dog. <laughs> But nice. I think I think, I think Harry has the conky dong inside him. 
No, what? Indeed. <laughs> Indeed. I'll, uh, I'll end it there, so, um... Yeah, I'll try to end the game tomorrow, if I can be bothered. Okay, thanks, bye.